Well, hello there. It is it is nice to see you guys again. Um, technical experts. So we all committed for one move. If you, if you guys are seeing this bot, my PC just lagged like there was no tomorrow. Uh, chat got to be IT technicians today, and the one thing they voted on was first restart PC and then update drivers. I have done both. And it is my pleasure to announce that we are not going to have any more lags. Zero dropped frames so far. Uh, actually, I kind of hate that result because that means you guys were smart. And the more smart you guys are, the more I have to listen to what you say. When really, I just like to do what I want all the time. Uh, but okay. Bad PC Keck W. You think bad PC or bad caretaker? Now, is it really the computer and the components that are bad, or is it like the the user? Because I feel like my PC in the right hands is a goat. I feel like I might have not taken the best care of my computer. Uh, might be the reason. Oh, can you guys not hear the music? I'm jamming so hard. Huh. <gasps> That would be a disaster if I started like singing along and stuff. That is so bad. Okay, good. Good, good. Some kind of magic. See, if, that, if I sang that without the backing track, it would sound pretty bad. <laughs> we need the backing track. Every time you say my name. Alright, let's get into it. Guys, to, in today's stream, I'm gonna play a map uh, you might have seen called World of Wampus. It's a 100 checkpoint trial track. 100 checkpoints. Uh, and I'm gonna try to beat it. Now. Hello, Mr. Race, a nice haircut. The only problem is going to be time. Time is a problem. Because right now it is 1540. I would love to be done until a couple of days. So I need like a three hour first completion of this track. That might not happen, but if it doesn't, that's okay. Uh, we'll see. We're just going to play it though. Legendary Fighter, Chaos, Anton, Pop the Caster. Thank you guys all for the resubs. Let's see what this map is about. People have been calling on me to play it a lot lately. I'm happy to do so. You will succeed. I hope I will. I hope I do will succeed eventually. This guy, Sigma is dude. Are we gonna have frame drops? I'm scared. Uh tweaker. Enabled. This guy, Sigma is and then one more thing I need to do is definitely turn this back up again since it wasn't a frame issue. Uh, 200, 100, 100, yeah, I, I, okay. All right, first attempt at this map called World of Wampus. Let's first see where to go. Uh, oh, looks like you plastic bounce on this onto the beam. Drive on the beam into the track point. Looks like that's what you have to do. Quite intuitive, really. It is not my third attempt at this after two restarts, I promise. It works. It is so much better. Huge. So apparently the lag has been cast away. Like, the game is supposed to look this smooth. Does it feel like you just went to the optician and got your vision checked and realized you can actually see for the first time? Is that what this feels like? Alright. Cool. Uh, first checkpoint done. This second one. Just gotta do that. There's a hundred of these. You can see it just above the timer, which one we're at. Right now, two out of a hundred. And what I've heard is that the later checkpoints are the harder ones, so. Pup, you just finished chat, it feels so good. 
<laughs> Alright, little bit of a hassle with tech support, but I'm glad we got something better at least. Supposedly, checkpoint 68 is the tough one there, Chad is saying. Parker, thank you for the, the, the 420. What do we do here? Just this? And then... This is the one that was... Yeah. Up through that gap in the loop. Ooh. This should be enough. And that should be checkpoint three. This guy's Sigma is... Now... Good. I have never seen this before, this is my first attempt, but this checkpoint, uh, the one that I've never seen before, is notoriously annoying. Because you have ending off down this plastic hill, uh, and you have to get all the way down. Uh, you might ask how I know this on my first attempt, but I... I just... It's giving me... You know, like, when someone gives you bad energy? Like, there's just bad energy in the room? <laughs> That's the feeling this checkpoint provides. Oh, so close. Hope you know the cast on Sunday. I, I did, Turbo. Thank you so much for stepping in. It was really, uh, it was really, really nice of you. Funny story, uh, Turbo. Uh, that day I was out disc golfing with friends. And I later went to my friend's place to barbecue. And I wanted to see how the cast was going for you guys, so I put... TM World Tour on the TV at my friend's place in the living room. And it's it's me, it's like my brother, it's a couple of people there. Um, and one of the guys, right, comes up to the TV and he goes like, oh, Trackmania. Uh, is that what you're watching? Trackmania Grand League? And I say, yeah, uh, we're just watching the games today. And he goes, oh, that's cool. You know, I haven't played much Trackmania, but the only Trackmania I've seen is that, um, that Norwegian guy on YouTube. <laughs> Uh, is he participating? Is he like competing right now? And I said, no, I don't. I don't think he's good enough, unfortunately. <laughs> but I think because of my new hair or whatever, he didn't recognize me. And so that my brother just goes like, "Are you talking about this guy?" He points at me, and he's like, "Wait, are you, are you virtual?" And then he felt so embarrassed. I was like, "Yeah, yeah, that's me, the guy who's not good enough to compete." <sighs> but we did enjoy your cast. We did enjoy your cast, Herbal. That was my my point of the story. <laughs> yes, shit. You convinced me to start playing two months ago. So far, my best finish is qualified 8th and finished 24th on a cup of the night. Dude, that's so really far, good. I love the game. Wait, how long did you play? Two months ago? Top 8 cup of the night qualifier? That's really, really good. We have a new superstar on the rise. As long as you're having fun, that's... That's the main thing. Hey Virtual, isn't it easier for you to write when you go out more? It is. It's crazy. Woo! Which bra? Like, I've long had the mindset of like, any time that I spend not working, I could spend working. The grind, you know? The Sigma grind set. But what I'm realizing is, after long periods of time, it... You become less creative doing that. At least I do. Um, so, the, the hours that I work... Like, what I got done, for example, in two hours yesterday... Might have taken me, like, eight hours if I just sat inside all day. And I'd be more tired. So, I'm, I'm changing my approach a bit on that. Less working equals more work. It's, it's so weird. And I don't... I don't fully understand why that is, but it's just something I've noticed lately. So like, yeah. I'm doing more other things. I'm, I'm taking more time and I'm actually...
probably producing more. But it's kind of it's it's so wild. Like I when I started with this, right? It was during COVID. I had nothing better to do. I would min max every single small piece of my life chat. Like at an unhealthy obsession level. Stuff like going for a, you know, a one minute shower. Just like how quickly can I shower? How quickly can I spread butter on my bread to save like five seconds? Speedrunning every activity like IRL. But like it, 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 I think what I'm trying to get at is it doesn't make you more productive. Even if you do that, it just makes you brain rot. <laughs> This guy Sigma is good. Viet wheel. Milf, I think the ten months. If you optimize everything, you end up stressed all the time. Should have submitted that for best speedrun of the year. <laughs> no, but I don't think it's a good approach. I really don't. So now I have this relationship with myself where I try to balance doing one boring thing with one fun thing. So boring thing always leads Woo! to fun thing. Which and that is way better than just doing like, yeah, I can do 10 boring things in a row. Sigma grind set. Trillionaire mindset. It doesn't work in the long run. Also, we're catching up pretty quick to where I was at. Explain fun thing. It could be like, like as I said, frisbee goal thing, or I went to a lake with my dog. That was a lot of fun. I don't have a dog here, but my parents have a dog. So I visited them and took my dog to the lake. And she really likes the lake. Breed? She's a beagle. Long, floppy ears. Food addict. Buy a dog? At some point, I think yes. But while I'm a streamer, seems like a very bad idea. This guy, Sigma, is good. So, in due time. Whew. FPS issues were a blessing on Broy Face now. I highly doubt it. But I, I do want to just discover the map. Here's what I... Okay, we need, to, we need to figure this out already, chat. Even if... Right? L listen to me. Even if we don't make it for a couple of days... Do we still play couple today and then get the fastest first run on the map? <laughs> and we all pretend it's like a discovery run, like, oh yeah, I just knew where to go. Like if we get to say checkpoint 80 and we have to go couple today, oh well. Cause I'm down to do like more attempts of this, regardless. No. What if it's bobsleigh? Dude, I hope. Hope we can have more bobsleigh couple of days. Why can't bobsleigh just become like a mainstay style in couple of days, you know? Why does tech get to be a mainstay? Full speed? Dirt? But bobsleigh? It's like a Christmas miracle when they pick it. Oh, 
Oh, this aim tech point. There's one tech map every two months, you're right. Tech is also pretty rare. Speed tech is less rare than tech, I feel. Like, you have so much speed tech, or... Whatever you want to call it, like a normal map. Yo, Shirnu, I've been doing really well lately. I've had uh, summer vacation, effectively, the last couple of days. Fourth gear grass. I won't lie, if it's fourth gear grass day, we're not playing a couple of days. I've just... Oh, I've hit my limits with grass. Oh no, I lost 0.2. Alright, I'm out. <laughs> it's not fun. It's just not. Six moth amused. It needs something to spice it up. Like, uh, why are people not building grass maps with a bug slide in the middle? Why are people not building grass maps where you have like an insanely cool no slide you can do? Just something. Just spice it. It's like eating like dry bread. It's playing grass. But if you add some good like toppings, then it's it's okay, you know. Think of the new players and how much they would enjoy dry bread. Okay, guys, we've actually caught up to uh, to where we left off before the disconnect. <laughs> Though you're probably not gonna see that because it was so laggy footage that Ellen Star is just gonna cut it out regardless. But hi, uh, yeah. This so is now weird. I have not seen I any more of the map. Um. Wasn't this the first one? Well, yes, it is. I'm sorry, I just... You know, I just felt really good about the rest. And also, I think I have a good feeling of where to go here. It's here, right? Oh, wow, how did I know? And then it's like here, right? Oh, wow, that's crazy, actually, that I saw that. Oh, it's, oh, I didn't see that, though. Wait, so it's... Oh, it's just up there. Woo! Which prize? Impressed how fast I were? Yeah, no, I have seen this very first bit. Colonia, thank you so much for the 20. A jar donut, lucky. Pitymus, just Alex as well, thank you. It might be smoother for it to be an integer multiple of the stream frame rate. Integer multiple. So like, it is double of the stream frame rate. What's something else you do that for? I can't- Camera shutter speeds, right? Also, I can save this. Isn't camera shutter speeds like twice the frame rate? He was so smart, but then he was so stupid. This is maybe not worth trying, but okay. Hopefully, this is the one. <laughs> so up there. No stive down there. Oh, that's a, okay. You need to go like right so you can go this left. Guy, is, dude. Wild. Has chat ever heard about Twitch Prime? Spooky snacks. Think of the three months. I had a lot of primers earlier today. <laughs> Appreciate it. You've been training past week on full speed getting top 1k on the hunted maps. Do you have any good more tips for more advanced full speed? More advanced. You can gain so much by learning proper wall rides. And proper cake lines. That's something that people overlook. They only focus on speed slides and airtime. I have heard of it now. Uh also tubes. If you figure out how to drive tubes very well. Oh my god. Ooh. 
Which prime? Punk prime. That should be good. Ooh, no. Ugh. Okay, we're fine. Oh, I got a bad respawn here, I think. Cake line? Yeah. <laughs> There's a building structure in full speed you call the cake. Can I make that? No, I should respawn. Embrace the cringe. That's the full speed advice I got from, from Mora. Whatever that means. This guy's Sigma is dude. Here. Just here. What's up with Wertuel's hair? Do you okay, so one in chat if you like it, two if you don't. It is literally just a matter of I don't wanna have the same haircut for my entire life. Do you, are you guys planning to have the same haircut your entire life? Like, you you see one thing, it's like, oh, this works, okay, I'm not gonna change it, ever. <laughs> Go for middle split? No, but in, then then you look like, um, sus in Norway, and that's not something to aspire to do. You look, um, posh. Posh people have the mid split. You don't look sus, no. <laughs> not a single person in Norway is posh. You could not be more wrong. I am so good. sorry, but. <laughs> you really gifted a tier one sub to Roy what are we doing here? Ooh, this guy I think that's it. magnetic. Dude. More speed. Today, be it. My wife is leaving me for a man named Esteban. He wears the same tank top every day. At least she didn't leave you for a 2003 Toyota Corolla. <laughs> it could be worse. You could have your life like the one guy in my comments who's like, "Damn, this really reminds me of the time my wife left me for a 2003 Corolla." This guy. He's still there. Dude. Almost every Return video. Of Kekman. Almost every video, he's still there. Wow, you did the first checkpoint so fast? Almost as fast as you did that last map in Bingo, Scrappy. What's up with that? You got that last one so quickly? Damn. <laughs> Still upset? Well, he didn't apologize. Of course. He didn't apologize. I was so invested. You did twice, you got a donor wall? Okay, I might have not seen it. Which But to be honest, it was 3 a.m. I was sad. Why is Carl Jr. so rare to see play? Because he, uh... He's honestly just a chad. He studies some type of, like, engineering degree. Shows up whenever there's a tournament. Plays the tournament, then closes the game. He spent so many hours getting so good at Trackmania that he just opens the game. Destroys everyone in the tournament, closes it, and then comes back for the next one. And then the rest of us are sitting out here like every day grinding. And very rarely do you see people beat him at the, at the end of the day. He's been streaming recently? Yeah, well, for the Ascension tournament, right? I need to go early on this corner. Like, I feel like I'm skipping so much of the red. I found a YouTube Dragon Clash stream? You came in at the right time, because if you were here like 30 minutes ago, it was just a lag fest. Total despair. Ascension might be in English, do I know anything about that? Uh, I, I will say what I always say, which is that... Uh, I know nothing about that. And if I knew something, I still couldn't tell you. Is that a plastic bounce? 
Beautiful. Beautiful. But it's cool if uh, Serrata wants to do it in uh, English. Because... Uh, <laughs> because there are a lot of fans that would watch in English, right? I think that would be a good move. Every time Serrata hosts a tournament, we've traditionally had a viewing party on the stream. And even before that in Discord calls. But, um... This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Would be cool if there's a cast. 33. Wow. Colorado, they were the 33 months. Uh, is it just that? Oh, I could have committed for that. Which checkpoint is he on? So, uh, yeah, any checkpoint you can see is at the bottom middle. 16 out of 100. It will always be above the timer. And the bottom timer is a super interesting one. It is what my run would be if I well, never made any mistake. She is morning. I just got my cafe mocha ready to watch some nonsense. Some nonsense. This guy's Sigma is good. Welcome. Wasn't old ZRT an English cast by spam? Uh, there was once a cast by spam, yeah. But I think he only did it one year. Is this gonna be a video? <laughs> I don't know how. <laughs> so far it started terribly with a bunch of lag. But I know if this is like a 7 hour of bot, it's the exact content that my this dear YouTube viewers love to fall asleep to. Dude. This is like a lullaby. Just upload the entire 7 hour footage of me playing this map and it's gonna do numbers. Was that a magnet up there? Yeah, magnet. Oh, and then you turn around. Ooh. Do you take your history for granted? Cause I've been hyper fixating on stone triangles and circles for weeks and it's all your fault, be it fine. I do not take my history for granted and I also tell my friends and ask them if they take their history for granted. <laughs> Dude, I'm sorry. If you went down the pyramid rabbit hole because of me, I'm truly Dude. sorry. Hey Virtual, 11 days since your last main channel video. When yes. When you won or did your channel go into coma again? Wait, so how often do you expect a new main channel video? It... How often? 11 days? Like, is that a coma? Weekly? I already said, it's gonna be two weeks after the first one. So 11 days? You got a new one this weekend. Think about it like this, how, how often is Christmas? How often is your birthday? These, these are exciting events because they are infrequent. I'm a casual TM player. What do you think what division you can get if you play COPT every day for a month? Starting at Div 20. Ooh. I'd say... You could probably go up about... I mean, uh, okay, so around, like, I'd say around Division 10, like, top 600, it starts to get pretty tough, right? When you approach, like, top 10%. Actually, maybe a bit lower, but like, um, if you have 4,000 people playing couple today, then top 10% would be about top 400. Getting further and further into the top 10% of anything is very hard. But I think you can definitely re then reach like, yeah, around Division 10, maybe on your bus. Okay. Oh, I need to like slow down just enough. I mean, yesterday, right? A new world record in typing was achieved. Uh, in the 15 second test. 
Guy called Rocket typed 300 words per minute. 300 words per minute. Took me two years of methodical practice to reach 150 words per minute. And the guy's like twice as fast. Like whenever you start doing a new hobby or whatever, it'll feel so futile. You'll feel like no matter how much time I put in, I will never be as good as this guy. And that will be true for everything. That delicious like food you made, there are better chefs. That new personal best you had on your morning jog, someone could run it faster. It is very unlikely any of us will ever be the best at something. I don't know why people complain main channel uploads. Virtual TV does get daily uploads, right? That YouTube channel you run where you upload one video every two weeks, someone uploads one a week, right? That's that's my extent. Someone will always be better. We will never be the best, but we can always do our best, Chad. You should, you should rather compare yourself to your previous best than to everyone else. Because it just takes away the joy of seeing your own improvements. If I didn't upload for 7 months and I upload after 14 days, that's a ridiculous improvement. That is so much better, right? I'm happy with that. Why should I compare to everyone else and then feel sad when I'm doing something that I should be proud of? Compare your results to your previous results. Like the same with like pull-ups, right? I'm weak as shit if I compare myself to Knut. But when I started doing pull-ups, I could do one. Now I can do like seven on a good day. In a row. Before I gas out. That's big improvement. And if I get 10, I'll be even happier. But you know what I mean? It's like... Take, take joy in the journey and seeing yourself improve. You don't have to speed run to get to the top level of something. There are more ways to enjoy something than being the best at it. Okay, uh, so right around this point is where I really don't know anything more about the map. I don't think I've seen streamers play these track points. I don't think I... No. Not seen streamers play these, these track points from here on out. And also not uh, gotten here myself, so... This is unexplored. What's the standard time slot people play? For a couple today, it's uh, 7 Central European. That's in 3 hours. Is this just... Huh? 20? Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Maybe not that bad if I can stop here. I don't think I can. No. Alright. One second. Gotta get to my playlist. Because that song, as good as it is, is not stream safe. Let's go here. Fell off. Okay. Same side for consistency. Cool. Checkpoint 20. Oh, that looks far. Do you have to gather speed here? How do you it? Hello. Lucky charm cereal, thank you. 20 of where? Is this a hard attack point? Okay. Uh, I mean, it's not gonna make me much faster. Why does that feel so criminally far away? Sigma is, dude, it looks so I far. To ask to order pizza here. Order pizza in chat. 
You know, I... One... I wonder if you actually could. You probably could. Like, with how many different people are in chat, there's a chance you could order a pizza from a pizza worker in chat currently slacking on his job as there are no customers early in the day. But, like, what? It's so far. Uh, think. No. Woo! Twitch Prime! Loved your main channel video, Wordle. Oh, thanks so much. Go more over the hill, dummy? Well, I'm going as much over the hill as I you can. The, the, you can't hill the hill any more than I'm hilling it. Okay, I could probably make it. It's like down the middle though. With uh 180 Nowadays, kind of thing. Nowadays, if someone subscribes, is it not even interesting slash important? It is not that it's not interesting or important. As I've said, I've tried to catch just about every sub I see. But it's also, and this is gonna sound really dumb, at a point where it's really hard to keep up with. As in like since I'm streaming and these become YouTube videos, if the entire video is thank you X, thank you Y, thank you Z, thank you A, thank you B, thank you C, if the entire video is that, then the people who also watch this in a VOD format are not going to get as much value from it. So I try to do both. For example, I mute alerts in a couple of the days, and then I check I keep alerts after. The cup of the day. Always got to wait for the YouTube button. It's not that it's sad, but it's like... This guy's Sigma is... Dude. I, I try, you know? I try. I'm trying. But I do appreciate the support. Copy, I think for the 29 months. But I also hope that people don't only subscribe to have their name read out loud. Because I will read your name out loud even if you're a non-sub in chat. I hope you, you do it to support my content regardless. Or get cool emotes or no ads, what, what, what it might be, but... Really? But you have such a hard name! Forza, Forza... <laughs> Potato is great, sure I'll see your name. Scrappy, I read your name, don't unfollow. This guy's Sigma is... Dude. 16 months FTW. You won't read mine, Candel W, okay? See, you know, but do, do you see, like, this to a YouTube viewer would be entirely uninteresting. This guy's Sigma is... And I'm not trying to say that the YouTube viewers are more important than you, chat. Back, Kappa. But... <laughs> I saw yo, even the nine months. We saw this weekend, totally right? Reasonable. The most important is the quality content you create. I'm not saying YouTube is more important than you, chat, because they're not. But I have to, as the as the mediator of this entire family, try to balance things out. They just want to sleep. You guys want attention. How do I how do I please all of you? <laughs> I don't know. Also, I think I'm figuring it out finally. What's after? So I don't miss it. Red boost? Is it backwards? Oh, yes, 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 yes. Still going for 20 world record? No. But yeah, I've said this before. This, like, if you're a smaller streamer, 
And you have this guy's Sigma ambitions of one day becoming a really big streamer. Like yesterday. You should really cherish the time you have with a chat that is like 200 people. Or less, right? When you recognize every single chatter, you kind of know what they do for a living. You have a literal parasocial relationship with your early viewers. And that's cool. That's okay, right? It's actually kind of fun. But you, you know people on like, oh, like a more personal level. You almost become online friends. Right? Maybe that's not parasocial. Maybe that's literally just becoming friends with people. But then at a certain point, at a certain point of growth, the chat becomes too many people. There's like too many strings being pulled at the same time that the only way you can communicate is by communicating to everyone at once. Chat. You're noticing I'm not saying Thick Boy alone, even though he's been here a, a while. I'm saying chat as a whole, as a unit. Talking to all you guys. You are a unit. Giga Chad. <laughs> did I save it? Did I sa Did I save this chat? If I call you a unit, will you forgive me? <laughs> An absolute unit of a chat? The strongest, most bulk chat there ever was? So how can I get more boosts? What if I... Wait. Okay, I have an idea, and this is going to only give me marginally more speed. Uh, so, sorry this is so, like, well, Pepega, but I, I have an idea. Woo! Twitch Prime! Shouldn't this be pretty fast? Okay, good. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. It's just a jump. One jump and we're there. Cool. Just jump forehead. Yeah. It's like the voices in your head. You should cherish when it's just two or three. Because when they are too many, you can't just pay attention to each of them separately. Shit, dude. When when there's too many personalities in your head, it gets crowded. I know. I know the feeling. <laughs> Hell yeah. Great analogy. <laughs> you know, me and you were just like, you know exactly how it is. Thank you, David. Also for the Prime. Crispy, Shooter, and Delios, and Fintzeri. But yeah, that's, that's actually like... To finish the point I was having, it is a fear of mine that it comes across as... that I don't care. Or that I don't appreciate it. Uh, the support, if I miss alerts. And I think every streamer feels this. Like, you see a big donation, then you missed it, or it's like, it's couple today, and you muted alerts, and you don't catch something happening. It's like... It's very hard to, um... Wait, are you supposed to get all the way up? Because there was something here, too. Maybe you're supposed to land on this. But yeah, just know, like, I really appreciate it. I do. Can I be your passenger princess? I actually just had my car cleaned. And what I noticed shocked me. 
It shocked me, chat. I had my car clean both inside and outside. And when the when the when the dust was gone, there was a massive like um visible like what do you say? Like the, the like the paint of the car had been Woo! like shredded. Which bra? Love you, worth. I don't know how to explain it. it. It was like on the outside of the car. It's not like not like a dent, you know, but like scratch. Yeah. Oh shit. Uh, massive scratch on the side that I've never seen before, and I think some idiot has hit my car and then just ran away from the scene of the crime. I literally think some idiot has just scraped my entire car and then just ran away. Because I've never seen that and I would notice. What is the, what what switch mode is this? <laughs> this is Lentilion. Nice. Who would do such a thing? This guy Sigma is, dude. Two years wahoo. Stare. Me. Caffrey, thank you for the two years. BMXer, thank you as well. Oh. Can you recommend banging my head to increase in intelligence? Banging your head. What? I don't think that works, no. Is it 23 down there? So just drive on it? Or stop here? Okay, likely stop here. But at least the car looks like nice inside now. Looks very nice inside the car. Dude, this is so awkward to drive on these blocks. Okay. We do the... Deep fear, not deep fear, deep dip trick. <laughs> okay, that looks pretty good. Where are we going? Okay, so if I don't release, I actually land there. I'll show you guys uh, what I'm doing, but it's a really smart trick if you ever need to line something up. Basically, you can test with the camera to see your approach. And get an exact lineup. Uh, it was actually used in khaki first and then on deep dip. So you see like I'm noticing like there's a line on the middle pipe. I line that up with my antenna thing. But to get this perfect, what you want to do is press camera 7 and then just press forward. And I see that this one is going to miss a little bit. So I put a bit left. That looks better. Go backwards. And it's going to work. You don't even want to land there. Oh, you just want to bounce. Maybe upside down. Okay, but still. The, 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 the trick still works. Just didn't see what you had to do. Uh, can I get this back up somehow? Oh. Looks pretty good. All the way back. I think this, if I had to guess, is perfect. Yeah. So I think it's just this then. No? Could also be insta air break. <laughs> Maybe I'm overcomplicating it. 
Have you heard of this car by Toyota? It is a hatchback with a fuel economy of 64.1 miles Whoa. per gallon. I think it's called a Corolla. 300 horsepower? That sounds like a great car. I'd love to drive that. Okay, how about, how about, how about? Ooh. This map is difficult. Unless I have the completely wrong idea on how to do it. I'm not sure. What can I do different? No stipe? I could no stipe a little bit. No style like oh to here ish and hope for like a better forward momentum. Aha. Cool trick. Uh Okay. Looks like a very simple checkpoint. Unless... Oh wait, do they both slow you down? So you have to go in between them. And then back. Ah, I see. And do you where does this jump lead? Woo! Twitch prom! Ooh. What? I'm just gonna assume that's all kind of press forwardy. When you build something like this, it's kind of just. I hope it's press forward. Oh, now I could use the red. Dude, why didn't... I could totally have used the red because it gives me speed in this angle. Right. It does not give me speed the other way, though. I see. So you dodge the boosters now because they're facing the other way. I don't think I need to do one backwards here, but it makes it a lot easier. I get it right. And then... So it's magnet. I want to bounce backwards. I know that. Do I just... Yes, that's what you do. <laughs> cool, cool, really cool trick. But like, wow. <laughs> okay, so like, this should be enough, right? Ooh, that's barely gonna land. I was trying to angle so I had more space, but I... I did not. Okay, I'll get it now though. I can see what to do. So here, catch the booster because now we have the speed for it. Bounce on that tile of plastic. 
land up here, angle a little bit this way. Not too much. Oh, that's too much. Is it? No, no speed. Um, you know, I do think this almost works. Levi Zoom, thank you so much for the raid. Surf. Oh, okay. I connected the dots. This is the guy who sets all the surf records. I've seen you like halfway through an ESL tournament that'll be like surf and chill by Levi. Damn. He's the GOAT. Wait, or is he? Or is it Caffrey? I don't even know anymore. Uh huh. He knows. Streamer is aware. I better get a stream. We're playing a uh, long map today. <laughs> really difficult trial map. 100 checkpoints. Uh, just to see if I can finish it. And how long that would take. This is one of the wilder checkpoints so far. Where I have to turn around. Get this bounce up there. Preferably land on that. Okay. 52 hours in. No, let's that'll be nuts. Game crash at 99. That actually happened to my roommate, Janik, on uh, a map like this. 13 hours into it. Just like a few checkpoints from the finish, his game crashed. And he wasn't too happy about it. <laughs> It was World of One Plus Two. Yeah, the hardest one as well. This guy's Sigma. This is one is slightly easier. Two. Almost what two years. Saying. This guy's Ooh, Sigma is yeah, two. Dude. Maybe I can just if I time this right. Yeah, that works. Just that. Perfect middle. Oh, I think I understand. If this doesn't work. <laughs> I can't understand what to do. Uh, it's the timing of when you shift from forwards to backwards. This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Took me a moment to realize. I also think I should just do this. Like, like one backwards, so that I get it 100%. Exatira, Destiny Doge, Dagger, thank you for the 23 months. Tom here, thank you as well. Okay, here. Like, if I just take my time, this works every time. Now then. Oh, that looks bad. <laughs> Ooh. Muchas gracias. <laughs> Made it. Okay. Woo! Twitch Prime. Thank you, Generic, for the Prime. Generic Hermit. So, what do we have here? This looks full speed. Yeah, just this is like that one royal map, but it's laggy. <laughs> it's the the one royal map with the slalom, but with lags. Left, no. Was there something there? Oh, you don't go around. You just go here into tunnel. Filled with no steer blocks. That looks fantastic. So you have to get like the perfect jump. <laughs> How sweet of the mapper Lentilion to place a million no steers.
average TMF precision map? Yeah. They do look something like this, usually. Any primers? Laser, thank you, Swap. Ah. Uh, yeah, so like, I've hit the no steering, the purple is no steer. And I'm assuming this is unsavable, but I just want to see it. There's no point, right? There's no point to try to angle this towards the. Woo! Which prime? Like, don't there's... forget to remember your Chad unit about the primes. <laughs> the Chad unit. Chatters. Oh? Like, there's. Okay, we're. From now on, if that happens, I'm just gonna go again. You just gotta land there without hitting anything. And it's like... The smallest hint to the left from the jump. Scrap a world record? I think it's by Naze. Naze did a 150. I don't know if Janik beat it, but he was trying earlier today, I know. 1 hour 50. Oh no. Full speed, I think. Or did I crash? This would also be easier if I had a slightly better respawn. Because the one I have now, I have low speed. So I can't like release a lot in the jump. That looks good. Oh, a little bit. So when you unhug from a corner like this, it can sometimes pull you to the side a little bit. Looks like these don't, though. Oh? Well, I mean, hey. Okay, now... Oh, no. Oh, I bottled it, I think. Because I could, I could very likely push this... to the side. Okay, whatever. That was savable. <laughs> okay, the walls are lava. We made it. Uh, so let's do the opposite. Let's go in with speed here. It's the other way. It didn't matter. <laughs> you have to go back. Or... Oh. No, I'm wrong for the third Whoa. time. It's backwards, is it? <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I see it though. Wall hug here. Loop. And stop. Alright, here. And then you accelerate exactly when the car hits the platform. Alright, yeah. You could forego wall hugging the first to only hug the second, almost. Almost. But the more you wall hug here, the better. I'm trying to think about that second turn. I don't understand it. But maybe it's just enough like this. It should be. We're just trying to get a better PB. I've never played this map. I've actually never played any of the Wampus maps. And I'm thinking, is it worth to go back and play the old ones at some point? 
This guy is sick. Maybe. Dude. 16 years already were tweaked. How far is that? Woo! Which bro? Because I could actually like do a do a marathon almost where I play through as many as possible in a stream. Mara has done these like speed ones where he'll play every Wampus map back to back. And I think he's one of the only people doing it. Also because he's just so good at it that like challenging him at it is a fool's errand. Uh, but... But yeah, maybe I have to check out the old Wampus maps. Good content seeming struggle, is it? I thought the best content is when I am the champion, when I win. The best content I can make is when I when I always do well. Uh, I need some water. One second. Uh, okay. Is it pressed forward? I don't think so. I don't think so. Water, copium. Like it's water. This guy's Sigma is, dude. It's hair literally you. water. Nice hair, sparkles. Hi, Sparkle. Like, I got this at the store. What do you mean? Not water. Let me let me enjoy my water in peace. Woo! Twitch bra. <sighs> Jesus. Man can't even enjoy his water in peace. <laughs> Without being berated. Alright. <sighs> now I feel refreshed. Ready to get this check. Wah. That's pretty far. Oh, you go under. You go. Also, I got pushed by that, so I need to steer more left. You go there. Ever tried the water cherry? <laughs> cherry water? Nah, I haven't. Crap, this thing for the prime. I've tried vanilla and I didn't like it. Vanilla water. If that's water, the dolerite can easily quarry granite obelisks. Dolerite can quarry granite obelisks. I saw this clip on TikTok, right, I chat? also like sipping my cool, refreshing coke, hashtag AD. So you already know it's gonna be good. I saw it on TikTok. Of this guy, and he was explaining the origins of the word dinosaur. Uh, now, it's actually a Greek word, right? And it stems from two words. So the word dino means, like, uh, terrible. And sor means, like, lizard. So, like, terrible lizard, right? But here's the problem. The dinosaurs and the Greeks existed at vastly different periods of time, if you would believe modern history. Uh, dinosaurs are said to be millions of years old, and the Greeks, you know, a few thousand, right? So which one is it? Did the Greeks exist millions of years ago? Or did the dinosaurs exist more recently? I mean, think about it. If you just go a little... a little to the south... There's a country with these massive blocks of stone that no one has figured out how humans could lift and make a monument called the pyramids. What creature could potentially lift massive boulders into the shape? <laughs> Anywho, I digress. Just, just an interesting thought, isn't it? Wow, what a thought experiment. Good luck trimming that out of the video. Whoever edits this and doesn't want me to talk about it. See, my editors don't even want me to talk about it. They're part of the government. They're, they're trying to silence me. Good luck editing that out. It was in one of the best checkpoints on the map. 
at... Like, I'm getting YouTube comments and they're like, what's this pyramid bit? Because they haven't heard anything. It's been a bit in my stream for months. For months, you guys and I have had a lot of fun talking about the pyramids. YouTube has no idea. They don't even know it's a thing. This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Good luck, Buckley Keck. Wait, how? Do I go up there? That's where I have to go, right? Let's keep it that way. I mean, let's be honest. But when have I ever said something that's like outright wrong? I might have said something you don't agree with, but that's okay. But wrong? Scientifically provably wrong. <laughs> Oh, it's just... Okay. <laughs> and this, my friends, is why... <laughs> you should always explore every possibility before you... I don't... I don't think this is the way. I think Buckley secretly wants to learn more about these big chunks of stone than you. It has to be backwards. But then where to? Should probably check that as well. That was quite evident by the, the scenery. It's up there. I also think, I also think so. If you actually look into the topic, it's pretty interesting. So, unironically, can I cook about the pyramids for one second? Can I cook? I will also give those that just refuse to hear anyone else's viewpoint than their own a chance to mute the stream. It's fine. You don't have to listen. <laughs> no. <laughs> you say something that's wrong each time you say you are drinking, quote, water. You can mute, you can mute the stream. Okay, listen, listen. I am not a conspiracy theorist. Hey, at Wirtual, I heard in a YouTube video something about internal ramp theory. Could you explain this to me? And I wouldn't even say the internal ramp theory is a conspiracy. It is quite likely the best explanation for how the pyramids were constructed. Yeah, yeah. Being very honest with you here. But why are you telling me to stop? It is just... It makes sense. Woo! Twitch prime! Oh no, stop! He's dismantling the external pyramid. The external ramp on the pyramid. Like... The argument is, if you build the pyramids of Giza, and especially the Great Pyramid, the external ramp that you need has to be of such size Woo! and length. And size matters, because it, it would be bigger than the pyramid itself, in terms of materials needed. The ramp you make, like the ramp you need to build the Great Pyramid has to be bigger than the pyramid itself and span for several kilometers to be gradual enough that you can actually like pull stones up the hill. It makes much more sense to have an internal ramp and some pulley lever mechanism that you use while inside. Yeah, I cooked. It just makes way more sense. They probably use slaves, they probably used mammoths, I don't know, but... What I know is... Or what I'm assuming, rather... Is... They, they built it with ramps inside the pyramid. So what we think is like a monument, like the Great Gallery, is probably just a lever. 
like a pulling mechanism. And the great void, the void that's above the bit, the grand gallery is probably also the same. My current guess is that the 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 big void that the scan pyramids mission found. So if you don't know what that is, uh, basically they went as far down as they could in the in the pyramids into the subterranean chambers, and they um, I'm going the wrong circle around here into the subterranean chamber, and they put a sensor, okay, and then they received a bunch of particles called muon particles. Uh, and with this, they were able to detect where there are gaps inside the pyramid. So everyone keeping up so far. They found a bunch of gaps. These are empty spaces that they saw in the pyramid structure. And then what they did is, um, they mapped these out where they are. This guy's Sigma is... The, the location of them, right? And there was one that was in the news recently. It was just explored near the North Face Corridor, right? Proving that the technology this that they use Sigma works. Is it is sound dude. science. They put a camera in there, they saw, okay, this is an empty gap. There's one that's like 10x the size. If, he, if not even more, it is massive. Just an unexplored void inside the pyramid. They Don't call it the big void, the great void. Talking about this. No, I'm passionate. It's like, do I get tired of talking about Trackmania? No. So there's this huge room inside the pyramid that no one's seen because it's behind a lot of stone. And it's not really connected to any like corridor or anything, it's just um, a room which says, okay, maybe it's not so important ceremonically, maybe it's just important constructionally. Now here's the problem though. It's very unlikely that, that that one will ever be explored. It'll just remain a... a mystery, because... If you're, if you're the government of Egypt, it's like, okay, do we really want to go into this one room and risk destroying our greatest tourist attraction? Like, almost the only reason people travel to our country is to see this monument. Do we really want to risk destroying it? Probably not. They are very careful, and I mean very careful, about signs being conducted on the pyramids. Um, so it is highly likely it will never be explored. But it is still a cool monument. Is there a, is there a thing here? It's still a cool thing to know that there is something there. That's pretty far. I zoned out. Can you explain all that again, please? Thank you for coming to my TED talk. Chat. This guy Sigma is, dude. Was that I interesting? I wanted to share this sub message at CP24. And then but there's you too fast. there's YouTube channels that explore how like they literally just explore the Someone stone patterns. thousands of years ago want to stack a bunch of rocks to confuse the f out of people in the future. Listen, th there's YouTube channels like History for Granite that explored the stone patterns on top of the other pyramid, the Pyramid of Khafra. So the great one is the Pyramid of Cheops, or Khufu. Uh, Khafra, the Pyramid of Khafra. And, um... Saw like, okay, it's likely they have been built in this way because the stones are really on this exact... Super fascinating! Super fascinating! Like, they were methodical. It, it was not just like, random blocks of stone, like, let's make a pile. It so calculated. They were smart. They were amazing builders. And the proof is the fact that the monuments still stand. Oh, thousands of years later. Who is he talking to? <laughs> you know what? There's a saying like, dance like nobody's watching. Well, I'm streaming like nobody's watching, okay? Your dog might be watching the stream right now, saying like, damn, who's this crazy guy you're watching? And you're gonna have to do a whole lot of explaining, but... Or maybe you I don't know. But I'm just gonna cook in my kitchen, okay? It is my kitchen, I get to cook here. <laughs> Barney Barnabas, thing for the 24 months. Now what? Onto here, maybe? This looks likely and unlikely. Uh, 
Uh, where is 29? What if you go one step lower? There's nothing to jump to. What if... Oh, is it just like some press forward thing? No, I've been here, right? This is the start. Unless... Oh, would you look at that? Wait, whoa, what is this? Ah, 29. Well, well, well. <laughs> so, where was I? Where was I? I got a bit distracted for a second. Where was I? Don't you think it's odd that pyramids <laughs> built after Giza are in much worse shape? Uh, yeah, but I think... Um... This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Three whole years. <laughs> Absolutely unbelievable. Looking forward okay. to three more Vietome. Thank you for all the content. Thank you so much it for has the been three worth years. Every penny. Thank you. Thank you so so much, Oak. I really appreciate it. Glad you're still around watching. Is this enough speed? No. Um now I was about to say, like on the regard of the pyramids being in great condition, right? I think it's it goes to show how much care they put into it. And I think later pyramids, they try to copy what the great builders of the first one did. Uh, and somewhat unsuccessfully, and also realizing just, okay. This is one dead person's tomb. Do we really need to go through all this effort? Like 20 years of building for one tomb? What about 10, you know? I think that's literally what happened. What about 10 years of building and we make it slightly smaller? And we try a different angle and stuff like that. Rather than um, the insanity that was the first one. The, the, the Great Pyramid. But then you also have like the Pyramids of Maidun and Saqqara. Where they try like different like step, step pyramids and stuff like that. It's good to know that I could not watch for like five years and you would still be talking about this. <laughs> Just giving you like a catch up. You haven't been here in a while? What's new in the pyramids world? But there are so many, there are so many aspects to it, right? Like, let's imagine, let's imagine, let's put this into Trackmania context, okay? Let's say, for the sake of argument, and you know any good argument starts with, for the sake of argument, that's, that's how you know it's a good argument. Anywho, let's say we found out people 3,000 years ago had Trackmania, okay? And we see that back then, we just know they had better records, or not better, but good records that we would struggle to achieve today. 3,000 years ago. We go like, oh my god, they had 2405 on AO1? 3,000 years ago? Huh? That makes no sense. Wait, they built like deep dip, but a bit more scuffed than we can do with modern tools? That's hell impressive, how? And they, they sourced the blocks themselves. Like, they didn't get the blocks from the in-game map editor. They actually sourced them themselves. How? Are you with me so far? Like... It is just... Th the fascination about the topic comes from the fact that they were so good for their time. If people tried now, they could reconstruct the pyramids quite easily, I think. Um, with, like, cranes and, you know, whatever. But for the time they were built, for the technology that they had, they were so clever, so smart. Did I mess up? Do I have to do this again? 
that's where the main fascination comes from. The Romans had steam engines. Oftentimes when I hear things like that, I can't help but think it's like an oversimplification. Like people will say like, oh, the Greeks had computers 1500 years ago. And it was like a small device that had like... Something. So yeah, they basically had modern computers. They were literally windows. Like I don't want to oversimplify it. They were they were smart, but they pretty basic, I think. Woo! They were gaming. <laughs> This guy's Sigma is... Dude. I've taken Abacus over Windows 11. An Abacus? I don't know what that, that is. I'm afraid. Maybe if I see it. Maybe if I see it, I will know. We're out of this is one and a half hours. Oh, the... Oh, yes, yes. The one with <laughs> What is it called in a region? Cool it on Okay. <laughs> great great term. Ball frame. Another instance of Norwegian just being the most descriptive language in the world. It is such a caveman language. Every time I hear a word that I don't know in English, it's because it's like so overly simplified in Norway. Like we have water boiler instead of kettle. Dust sucker instead of um, vacuum cleaner. It sucks dust. It's a dust sucker. It makes a lot of sense, <laughs> but it's very descriptive. Everything is just called by what it is or what it does. It's like everything. Have you heard of the Barabar Caves? <laughs> That's an another mystery for you, no. my friend. Someone in chat said the best one. Vegetable. The vegetable in Norwegian is just green thing. Green thing. And vegetables is green things. <laughs> Woo! This would be a sick save. Oh no. Bumper? I barely know her. Okay. What about carrot? Carrot is called yellow root. It, and that's a confusing one because it's orange, but yellow root. <laughs> oh no, I was trying to prevent exactly that, but it's fine. Katona, thank you so much, dumb this boy. And Mitch, thank you all. Mr. Stunt as well, thank you. Most carrots used to be yellow, really? <laughs> More great examples from chat, you got... Uh, strawberries are earthberry. Raccoon is washing bear. <laughs> so, I don't even know where that one comes from. Maybe it's just we copied Germany. Honestly, maybe we have to blame Germans for this. I'm down to take no responsibility, no fault, and just blame Germany. Yeah, a turtle is just a shield. Shield toad. Yep, that makes sense. Toad with shield. No, but I like that. I like that, and you know why? 
it's because it's just good communication. Like, the people who invented these words were not stupid. It sounds stupid, but they were really were not. They were smart as hell. Because it's like, how do you best communicate so that people know what you're talking about? Shield Toad. It's good communication. That couldn't really be another animal. Water boiler? Oh, I wonder what it does. Refrigerator? What the hell is that? Cooling closet? Oh, it's a door you open and it's cool inside. I'm lost. Woo! Wait. Switch Prime. Just here to give you free money real quick. Or whatever exactly Twitch Prime does. <laughs> Can you explain it to me? Excellent. Thank you so much. Yeah, if you don't know, that just gave me a free two and a half dollars. Because you checked if you had Prime available and clicked the button. And decided to support my stream. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. And to everyone else who's used their Primes as well. Thank you. If you already have Amazon Prime, it really helps if you use your Prime. I won't be doing that. That's okay. If not on my stream, then on someone else's. Twitch Prime. But a lot of the streamer ecosystem, that's what I always say, is literally just Primes. Woo! Twitch Prime. If you want to use it on Scrappy, if you want to use it on Lars, on Janek, whoever, Woo! then feel Twitch free. Prime. Just use your Primes. Twitch Prime! Ooh. Thank you so much. Or Buckley. Woo! Twitch Prime! Even Buckley. Even Buckley deserves your primes. Woo! Twitch Prime! Say no more and take my prime. How? Which prime? Am I bad? Also, where do I even go with this? That's what I wanted to figure out. Oh, 34. Woo! Which prime? Just got $24, right? Thank you guys so much. Woo! That is, Which thank prime? you for gifting yourself as well. I really like how the German and Norwegian words have the same meaning. Woo! I think Which prime? Norwegian is a Germanic language. I think that's why. Oh my god, so many primes. Checkpoint 34 is Bob Slay, is that a coincidence? This guy's Sigma is... Nothing good. in the world is a coincidence. Have you a tier 1 sub to Schmidt 45? Nothing. Woo! Add reality, I think for the 5 months. Don't even think for five prime. months. Woo. Do you guys believe you have free will chat? One in, <laughs> one in chat if you have free will. <laughs> this guy's Sigma is... Dude. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I'm glad so many of you guys decided to do that all by yourself. Woo! Twitch Prime. Take my Prime. Huge fan from Portugal via PLS. <laughs> Woo! Which prime? How? Okay, no, at this point, I'm an idiot if I keep doing the same thing. What must be done? That I'm not doing. Woo! Which prime? Would you... Maybe if you're fast, you can no dive Woo! all the way. Twitch Prime! Or maybe just a little bit? Maybe it's a wall hit.
This guy's Sigma is. Dude. No. I clicked the wrong button. Huh? Try slow. There's just no way that works. the wrong button they were 13 months Woo! Twitch El no sabe yeah well literally this it was so hot that was like five minutes of my life Still need to tilt the car a tiny bit, but that's fine. I'll tilt the car and boom. Oh. So much out is crazy. Yeah, the car just rotates faster backwards apparently. That's a really nice trick though. And a pretty good puzzle, honestly. Like, sometimes when these maps have Puzzles with a clean solution that doesn't come down to luck or whatever, but just like game knowledge. That's very nice. I like that. I do wonder if I'm still doing it wrong. Like, I want to max my speed, right? Uh, what about here? Oh, that's too much, right? Twitch bra. Is this Have not intended? There's a clean solution. I didn't find it yet. Wait, so this isn't it? I mean, it doesn't seem to work. Is it just that? Speed. Squig, thank you for the prime. Peppermint. Dorks. Thank you as well. It's so dumb. This guy's Sigma is. Dude. I swear if it's press forward. I swear. If it's I swear. I swear. I s okay, thank you. Like, what? <laughs> I'm sorry. Wait. What? I was reading chat and that somehow worked. That's probably not intended, but I don't want to miss this, so... Okay, I don't know what I did. Mercy. Mercy. Checkpoint 34! What was the strategy? Counter steer to flip. Right and then late left tap. Woo! Twitch bra. Okay. One point five years. Woohoo! I guess I did it correct. Uh, so what are we trying to do here? Loop, backwards and jump. Makes sense. You just want to jump. Oh, you want to probably just jump directly to that loop. It looks like you are so fast. Extend the car by having no sub. Hmm. 
interesting. Clip of it? Oh, thank you. Mikrim, thank you as well. I'm still too fast for that. And I'm just thinking, like, is it gonna rotate in time? Probably is. I'll check a clip of it after, probably. Chat. Before I do my next run. Assuming I do an- Oh! Because I don't know what he plays to help it rotate, but that's pretty nice. It normally probably wouldn't do that out of the loop. But cool. Where are we going? Wait. Is there actually a thing here? <laughs> you know what I really love? Having one of my senses just taken away from me. Not being able to see is just such an experience. <laughs> it's so... It's so, like... Rewarding as a gameplay mechanic. Yeah, I kinda see... You have to aim for this, I'm guessing. And then... 36, okay. Wait. This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Boy. How high up do you go here? Do you go here? That's kinda doable. I think that has to be it. I don't think you go over this. How old you? Thank you for the 45 months. Woo! Which problem? Okay, let's see. So... It's like... Halfway, and then... Oh wait! Is he connected? Maybe I don't need to rush. Yeah, I didn't need to rush at all. Oh, here I need to be a bit faster though. But then just... Oh. oh. I think this is... over. I don't know, sub. <laughs> Probably. Woo! Which prime? There's a lot of things I won't know about this. That's okay. If I just figure them out as I go along. <clears throat> go along. Level and hype. Thank you so much for the eight months. How close are we at? Honestly, not that far. Just here. This guy Sigma is... Dude. What this is not a prime. What? A regular sub? I appreciate regular subs too, thank you so much. Is that gonna make it though? Hey Skrexel, welcome to the stream. This checkpoint of where? What? I've heard people say 68, this is 36. What's so Woo! hard about this? It doesn't feel hard. It feels quite simple, really. Which prime? Okay, maybe it's not. There's a chance it's not. So, okay. 
Ah! <laughs> uh, I mean... No gap. Okay, now I think I, I still go down. But maybe I go up to the top one first, build speed, and then drop down. From a mapper's perspective, okay? You wouldn't place that booster unless it was useful. The reason you place this is because you expect people to use it to get up here. Build speed and then drop down there. And then with speed jump up here. Smart. Tech 36. Ba, 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 ba. Now what? Now what? I saw 38 earlier. Uh, that was 31, okay. 45? So we're gonna be in this area. 37 down there. You just drop into the middle? That could be it. Do you have to get a direct? Wait, if I internal against the platform... Yeah, if I- No, there's still another elevation to it. Oh god. That's pretty far. There's a booster, is there? El no sab- It says 37, hello? How is this not it? Are you guys gonna say El No Saba for the entire rest of the map? The only point you have is where is the actual checkpoint trigger? Where is the checkpoint trigger? Wait. Oh. <laughs> okay. That might be a shortcut then. Uh... Where is it? Oh, up there. First time viewer picked up the game on console, got hooked. Yo, nice, Zampa. Hope you're having fun. I would not recommend playing this map if you're just starting. It is a very difficult track media map. <laughs> yes, okay, and then, and then, and then, and then, and then, slow down. You're supposed to be sideways. You're supposed to be this. It looks like it's full speed. No. Rude. Playing as a console without a cam 7, yeah. I don't like the no cam 7 rule that people have for discovery runs and stuff. Do you find it more enjoyable to not see where to go? Like, is it more fun to first 
have to drive the car everywhere it needs to be to see like, oh, it's not there. Oh, it's not there. Or is it more fun to like see the destination and be like, huh, how do I get there? Oh, where's the check? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> okay, good. We spawn outside on a forced acceleration pad. And I have to go up there. You should cam 7 live because I have no idea where I'm going. Oh, where? <laughs> Damn, kind of shitty that we don't have cam 7 IRL. Oh, you have forced acceleration. When new video on your main channel? In like three days. Ish. Plus minus, but around three days from now. Oh shit, already? Yes. Like I've been telling chat this today. I am in a in a very creative mind space lately. Very creative mind space. So I'm writing a lot. I have a lot of drive to make videos. It's really good. This isn't the main channel. <laughs> God. As soon as this started becoming funny, I recognized I'm gonna have to hear that virtual TV is the main channel for like an entire year before you guys actually start treating my main channel as the main channel. That's okay. That's okay. But I'm just prepared to get so sick of the joke. And, um... <laughs> and that, that's all I wanted to say. I am, I am armored up. Cool, 38. Booster to there. Did you see what I saw? Did you see what I just saw? I saw my favorite block set in the game. Ooh. Bobslay! Do you guys like... Ice after the update? Do you guys think it was a good change? Or let's say if you could, if you had a time machine, would you go back in time and stop me from ever using action keys on Midori? Woo! Would you stop Fish me? Bro. Was was all the eyes better? That's far. Woo! What was the difference? Which you are my god. <sighs> the difference is that Ice has random slowdowns now because they tried to punish for one Wiggles and two uh, speed gains and bobsleigh based on your steering percentage. So the new physics are kind of um, janky in certain spots, but also I think easier for people. Like, new bobsleigh is easier. You will be less time behind a good bobsleigh player on new physics than old. Nope. Why didn't they make everything faster instead of slower? Because bobsleigh already was really fast. And if you make anything faster than that again, uh, your casual players are not going to be able to drive it. Like you see, if you if you think about if you play the game, how much you wobble on bobsleigh, and in this patch, uh, previously it was even harder. Ooh. You just joined. Has a Twitch discussion happened yet? It's not really much of a discussion, though, is it? The Twitch thing. It's kind of like everyone is like, "Yeah, Twitch bad." Can we talk about Twitch bad? Twitch bad. Did you guys see change Twitch bad? Yes, Twitch bad. 
I don't think there's anyone who's like, yes! I love that Twitch is taking these changes for ads for streamers. If you guys haven't heard, Twitch did this update yesterday where they said, basically, if you have branded content on your stream, like a NordVPN banner or, or whatever it might be, if it's over 3% of the screen space, that's not allowed. Why? Because they wanted to. If NordVPN sends you a video that they want you to play as part of like the deal, this guy you're not allowed to do that. Dude. Why? Because Twitch An Anonymous wants to. user gifted a tier one sub to Twitch bad. Honestly, thank you, Anonymous. And the, the entire idea is they want brands to work directly with Twitch rather than the streamers themselves. So Twitch gets a part of the pie, right? Twitch as the middleman can go, hey, if you go through us first, we get money. Right now, streamer get a lot of money and we get no money. We only take 50% of what streamers get from subscriptions, 30% from cheers, and we're still not happy. We also take a lot of the ads. But if we could have a little bit more, that would be great. You see, we're only owned by Amazon, trillion dollar company, and we're really suffering. Go on kick if it bothers you? People don't want to move though, I remember right? you talking about streaming on you when it got allowed. Did you ever do it? I uh, plan to do it now with these changes. Like, I think I might stream more on YouTube. But I won't, I, I don't think like, this you need to be so guys. drastic Dude. about it. I'm either 100% Twitch or 100% YouTube. I think I can do both. But I think YouTube is also lacking in certain ways. No, no streaming platform is perfect. Twitch, for all its faults, has a lot of good things. But they're getting very comfortable, okay? That's the main problem I see is Twitch is like, streamers are not going anywhere, so we can do whatever we want, kind of thing. We have no competition. Let's make it a 60-40. Let's take away Twitch Primes. Let's increase the amount of ads you have to run. Let's... Like, basically, they're getting very comfortable. And people will, if it gets bad enough, just leave. Don't give them ideas, dude. I think they've been thinking about removing Twitch Prime for a while. This is no revolutionary idea. I can't even imagine how much money Twitch Prime costs them a month. Woo! I cannot, like think about it. I'm a, you know, not the biggest streamer. And still, I think like, one to 2,000 of my subs are just Primes. It is just people clicking a button saying, here's some money that Amazon has to pay for. Amazon overall is not losing money, but Twitch probably is. Oh. I hope I'm doing this correct. I think I have to Woo! start the ice slide later. Twitch Prime. Thank you, Jack. For the Prime, Prolonite, 22 months, thank you. Woo! I'm starting to realize Which I might prime? not. Here is some money. Oh, so close. You've been doing the same thing for 10 minutes now, and you see how close it is? Woo! Which prime? Money, bro. It's almost working. Bobsleigh struggle? I'm struggling with an ice this slide. This guy Sigma is... Dude. Here's is some more money. Shammy and Brayden, thank you. Can you do a character to save it? I think it's direct. I think it's also good to learn it direct if I'm doing another run. Because it's starting to dawn on me that we're not going to be done with this for a couple of days. 
Maybe that's okay though. It depends on the map today. I said if it's grass, I won't play. Let's set this, the, the rules very clearly. If it's full speed, I will play. If it's tech, I will skip. If it's grass, I will skip. If it's dirt, I will skip. If it's RPG type of thing, I will play it. Backwards, I will play it. But no one builds back backwards. 39. Oh, that was actually intended. Nice. 39. These are very common on Wampus maps, and I am so bad at them. Do you have to hit the plastic at the bottom and then go back up? Into the light. Whoa, dink. And then... What? And then what? Onto the corners. Would suck to fail the last part of this, so just making sure. You can indeed. Oh no, it's just here. Right? Jump out here and hit 40. Hopefully that's correct. Yeah, this is the <laughs> eternal wall ride thing where as long as you have grip, you can do this to get up. And then you have to land inside that circle to go all the way. First time in stream, kind of lurk watching YouTube a bit. Just wanted to say a massive thank you. you. My uncle used to play and I completely forgot what the game was called after he passed. I found your channel and now I feel like I got away connect with him again oh my god my condolences but I'm glad you uh you've refound the game enjoy it Had an instant nosebleed? Had that ever? Yes? I can't remember when. It was recently. My nose just started bleeding. <laughs> I think it was when I was playing like a couple today or something. You've had instant noodles? Damn. Luxurious. So cool, you're finally playing this track? You're planning on playing all of them? Yes, I think eventually. But it's quite the project to play all the Wampus maps. I think for now, only the newest one, right? Only the newest one for now. Wampus 1, Wampus 2. Uh, um, Wamp Wampus 1 is easy, I've heard. Wampus 2 is really difficult. And annoying, like difficult in an annoying way, if that makes any sense. It will have checkpoints like a thousand cacti and ice spread across a little circle thing, and you have to drive with no steering. That's one checkpoint I remember from there. Or underwater driving, which is no fun either. So, less fun of a map, I think. You could categorize Wampus 2 as. Three, I don't remember. Four, I don't remember. Five, I remember a little bit, because it was recent. Do I have video with my camera settings? Uh, no, I don't. But all my, like... I think if you type exclamation mark camera, you get to know the camera. If you're talking about Trackmania, though, it's just camera one. For the most part. Why are the Wampus maps so popular? I think they're just really well-built, like, trial maps. It, it, it's... It's just the, the... The... The quality? Like, they're good puzzle maps. And then you have a hundred of them in a row, checkpoints. And it's cool to reach the finish. 
Okay, so that was not it. I tried to like oversteer, but it does seem like this only works if I um, am pointed towards the booster when I hit it. Like that. Okay, now it's gonna land in the water, right? So we're safe with the landing, and then it's just figuring out where. <laughs> Where was it? It is right under this here. No. Didn't I look at this? Oh, it's sorry. It's here. I think the way I want to do this, because I have wet tires and you can't air brake with wet tires, uh, is go out on the dirt drive a small lap and drop down in, in this gap here, right? That way, we are the least at risk. This guy's Sigma is... Dude. That'll be the gap that's to my left. The gap that's to my left. The gap that's to my left. So I want that one, that one, that one. Let me just... Because it's going to be very blind, I think. Yeah, this one. One, two, three, four. Okay. 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 It might seem chaotic, but I found a way to make it work. Why do wet tires prevent air braking? Doesn't make any sense. It doesn't, but it's just the way it is. Whew. Oh my god, so lucky. Yeah, all that was luck and none of it was planned out. I just went for it and got lucky. I totally didn't sit there and strategize. And come up with a good plan. It was just pure luck. God, I'm so lucky. <laughs> Isn't there a saying, like, skill is when luck becomes usual? Is that a cope, or do you guys believe in that? Skill is when luck becomes usual. This guy's Sigma is- People will sometimes dude. say Carl Jr. is so lucky. Is this scription? But he's pretty damn good as well. Uh, I think we just drive on these. Scam scription. Jesus, think of the three months. Depends on what you feel you're getting in return. You're getting my love and affection. Parasocially. <laughs> uh, a cool badge in chat. Cool emotes, no ads. And you are slightly more invulnerable to the mods. Meaning, if you type something that's cringe, but it's not, like, non-sub-cringe, then, then they might spare you. Oh. Like, it would be super cringe if a non-sub typed it, but, you know, you're kind of cool. <laughs> Woo! Do I get something else? What is something else? What do you want? What, what, what more can I give? A postcard? A signed copy of my book? Woo! Twitch bra! Uh, what do we do? It cannot- is it this? Luck is simply the combination of preparation and opportunity. I think so too. Um... If you're not ready to be lucky, you won't be lucky. Uh, I 
feel like this went wrong. As in if you're not ready to make use of the luck you are presented with. Ooh. Where do I go? Uh, this looks like a different checkpoint. I just want to see a number. Luck is when you wake up in 45? 47? 46? It does seem like we're going up. Uh, Luck's when you wake up in the morning. I guess. Don't take existence for granted. Thank you, Code Alive. De Dean Zontos, thank you so much as well. What am I not seeing? Going up here seems like the skillful part. And then drop down again? Like, what? You could miss a checkpoint if that was the path, so no.
Yeah, I'm just not so sure about this one. If it's doable. But why is the- oh. The checkpoint itself is actually down on that beam. Okay. That's why it says 46. Down there as well. Oh, but a six save. Has Manolo done them all in under one hour? All of them. Like every map individual record under one hour. Dude, I'm there. I'm literally there. Hello? Oh, wait. Do you see it's moving? Give me the tick. Please. Please. This would count in Rocket League. Or no, it wouldn't. And... Okay, now you're trolling. How <laughs> did not count to the checkpoint? Okay, there we go. <sighs> okay. Whew. I was about to call the referee. Great respawn here. Nice one. Is this I? Yes. It's all ice. Oh, and then forwards again. Was that a bit of drool? Yes. I'm an athlete, okay? If you don't sweat and drool, you're not taking it seriously. <laughs> Thanks for paying so closely attention, though. Yeah, if you didn't see, this is freewheeling, no brakes, ice. So, when you have boosters pointed against you, Woo! you can't clear them forward, you have to be the other direction, with the nose of the car. It's a cool thing it works, because then we can get past this. High performance athlete. Now you should see like, if you've never watched competitive skiing, it's crazy, right? Because they're competing in a cardio event in really cold temperatures. And every athlete, when they get across the finish line, they're just drenched in, like, drool and snot. It's all hella disgusting as shit. It's just... It's just, like... Competitive skiing serious, man. Like, they do not give a shit. They just go fast. But it's really, yeah. Uh, where? Where at the end? Up? No, that makes no sense. Where? Oh, down. Oh, this is a long time point. Right? Is this correct? Could it be? Wait, I lost it. This looks correct. This looks correct. Maybe. Is there like... I mean, it wouldn't really make sense to go here because you'd just be... going right past the causeway. Near the valley temple. There's this, though. <laughs> I 
Ok, ouais, 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 ouais. <rire> That might not look too bad. <laughs> I don't want to see a 47 up here. No, it's not. It's a different checkpoint. Okay, so it's not that. That's good. Because I got to here. Oh, and then was I supposed to go Woo! here? Twitch Prime! But... I think what that means is that I'm going to have to do that entire path later on. Like what you saw there with driving around the, the floor, like that's something we have to do. That's part of a checkpoint. It's just a later one in the map. I'm scared of that. Mason, TC, Rain, and Frixmer, thank you guys all. <laughs> I was gonna add it to your own channel, you misclicked. This Honestly, I'm all for it. Dude. Intox, I trust you. Add whichever 7TV emotes you want. Ten of them, okay? I elect you as the mayor of chat. And as mayor, you get to add ten emotes. Better, uh, sorry, 7TV emotes. Choose wisely. You only get ten. Number one. Number one. You got one in. If you can't see that cat blinking with its eyes, and you only see the text plink, you have to get something called 7TV. It's like a third party thing. <laughs> uh. With great power comes great responsibility, Intux. This is your chance. Why is Virtual looking like a 17 year old today? How old did you think I was? Boomer? Perfect, perfect, perfect. I want to listen to this one, but with the text. It's ending off, okay? Did you know it's time to raise our sails? Blah! <laughs> <laughs> Mark guy. Okay, let's try to set this up. Huh? It makes no sense. backwards no then 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 it has to be this yeah okay process of elimination thank you and flip and what about there? 
Not too bad. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> that is so close. Is it though? Still moving, it's still moving. And I, I can see the angle is kind of bad. Even even if we get this, the angle is still terrible. So I don't know. Chat, sometimes you cook and you realize you should start over. If you wanna, if you wanna cook a good dish, you sometimes have to try several times. How often do you cook? Uh, on occasion, I would say. I visited my parents, and I, I was the the grill master, the barbecue chieftain, um, which was nice. But I do prefer eating food to making food. I'm way better at it too. <laughs> Relatable. My favorite dish to make is lasagna. If you make it from... From good products. But my favorite dish in general is also lasagna. I think a lot of people make a mistake with lasagna to not have enough cheese. If I'm the cook, that lasagna has to be drowning, and I mean suffocating in a layer of cheese at the top. And then you start it on a pretty high temperature so that that cheese becomes like, almost like crunchy on top. It has some bite to it because the rest of the thing is gonna be soft, right? You can never, you can almost never put enough cheese on Melisania. Oh. 48. Oh, it's one of these. Is this press forward? Do you want to land on wheels or upside down, though? I guess that is intended? Where to? <laughs> Sometimes I see checkpoints Woo! in this map Fish and... Bar! My brain? Inside my brain! The only thing I see is, I only see his face. It's all I see, he's just, what? I can't see, I, I, I just see the yellow man. He's there in my brain. Oh. Why is it such a good emote? <laughs> It just perfectly describes my feelings. I've never had an emote validate my feelings as much as what? It's very slow. Ooh, 
That was really nice. 49? Probably not there. How about down here? That looks better. We get a super turbo and a dream. And we have to jump there. In order to do what exactly? Where's this guy? Sigma is. Dude. Hmm. Is this 50? Woo! 66. Okay, so that's the start of that awful one. Um, 13, we've been in that area. Is it up? 86. No. Okay, these are all the later attack points. Forgot to laugh. Lost Miracle Proxy Washer and JT. Thank you guys. Appreciate the support. Oh. Oh. No. <laughs> I don't know. I will just play and find out. What is this block? Turbo! This guy Sigma is... Dude. If it help, I don't know. I couldn't have seen that. I could not have foreseen that. Pyramid jump! I'm gonna hit the one... Was it past this? Yeah, I hit the one pillar. <sighs> okay, well at least I saw it. Maybe I was a little bit slow. It is possible to conclude that. And also bad aim, but it's hard to aim when it's so exposed like that, you know? It's almost distracting. How am I supposed to aim forwards when there's a beautiful pyramid to my left? <laughs> That's your choice. Do this IRL. Very cool. What did Masa call it? The Drilla? Do this IRL if you're a Drilla. Madrilla. Oh. Favorite cheese to go with lasagna? I'm not really
you have free will and you can stop whenever you want. Then it's just two friends having fun playing a game together. If you get across that with enough speed backwards, then you can get to the thing. But maybe you can also do this with the um, anti-boost drift thing.
Then probably at all speeds. That you can get here. Try this. Ice. And ice has kind of a special property. It's either... Guess it's either... <laughs> there to prevent you from doing something or to enable you doing something. I don't know. Try this chat. Wow, I'm glad I found that. I'm glad I found that by myself. I'm so smart. <laughs> no help at all. It's just my, my brain and I playing RPG tracks. Damn. Okay, thank you, Chad. Can I say thank you? Thank you. I appreciate the help. I admit you are superior. But it is kind of fun to watch me struggle, no? Or or did I struggle so much that you were just like, I can't watch this anymore. He is so incredibly incapable. Why does he not see? Okay, I have to help it. I have to help him. Was it like at that point where we just like, okay, I have to type it? Because then I understand. Intended? Sure. Intended? Sure. It's just the, the language of my people. Fifty-three.
54, have I seen that? No, but it's up there, 54. Looks like a staircase up on the outside. This looks promising. Yeah. Is this the worst shack point? It looks so free. You just go here. It can't be that hard. That's not a normal wall ride walk. I don't know what type of walk it is, but that's not normal. It might be magnet, which can make this very awkward. Fifty-three. This can't be that bad. More speed. Get okay, a little bit fast. I can even go up later than what I'm trying. Yeah, it doesn't have to be an insta climb. Simple and uninteressant, by the way. And she, Zard, thank you guys all. Oh my god, that was close. Uh, which side? I'm gonna keep my options open until I can actually see it, or? Yeah. I can either drop with, you know, the left wheels on or the right wheels. I think it's best. Yes, yeah, this will be left side. Just, just, it's very slowly. <laughs> okay. Like that. Oh, that's plastic, no? Okay. Uh, full speed, or you'll regret it, I think. The worst checkpoint, it's the worst, oh, it's so, oh, no, no, 53. No, no, oh, no, 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 no. I'm gonna get karma for that. I already know there's gonna be a checkpoint coming up. I'm gonna get stuck. And it's gonna be like, oh, he did 53, but can't even do 59, you this know? This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Okay. Easy clap might be the case but if that happens I will accept the consequences uh, how because here I'm thinking we have to get upside down unless yeah I'd love to turn oh maybe just this Uh, upside down Y, upside down so we can climb across this ledge. And then, I don't know what these are, but I saw no brakes, okay. Yeah, that's the checkpoint. How long until Midori 2? Mm, I don't know. Or I do know, but I can't tell you. <laughs> I actually know very well, uh, but I can't tell you. Plink. Sounds like it's done and waiting to be couple today. Uh, not... Not exactly. But I think when you see it finalized, when you see the map finalized, it'll make sense. Ooh. It's waiting for ascension to be done. I don't think a bobsleigh full speed map 
and French lol maps attract the same crowd. I'm not I'm not too scared about Ascension. Ooh. But guys, I cannot speak further about Midori 2. You will just have to see it when it's done. Scenery from the screenshots I've seen is beautiful. It looks stunning. The scenery builders put in amazing work. Can't wait to show it to you guys. One of them attracts no one? Okay. That's why I added metals. I already know. Like, I already know if I make a bobsleigh full speed map, no one's gonna wanna hunt it. So then I make real life author medals, and then it, there's a point to it. I'm not a tyrant. I don't force people to play, I give them sweet rewards so I can watch them struggle to beat me and incre inflate my own ego. Alright? It's a simple competition. Go minions, try to beat my time. <laughs> No. Is it the- oh, am I getting baited? You could either... You could either... How long are you gonna grind the author time? Probably a few... I don't know, like... 10 to 20 hours? Midori 1 was 15 hours? I would like Midori 2 to be about the same level. It's easy to get baited here because you have the middle path with like two beams, and you might think that's easier. That's what I started. At. But, but the um, the sides have one, and you can balance the middle of the car on that, which I think is better. It is, but does it get? Off the. Does it get off the roller coaster ride in time? What style is Midori 2? I, I built it on stream. It's bobsleigh and full speed and plastic bounces. But it's. Um, it's gone through some changes off stream as well from what I built on stream. So if you dig through the archives, you find the VOD of me building Midori. It's not going to look exactly the same. But it's pretty good. Take your time building speed, but it's no breaks. Ooh. But no brakes doesn't mean you're forced to accelerate. Woo! Switch bra! Good luck. Okay. Again, all, all me. All me, let me have some water. All me. I'm not coping. Dia boy, thank you for the two months. Caleb, thank you as well for the five months. This has to be over the fence, right? It was so tempting to jump over the fence. It, it'd be weird if it was anything Woo! else. Twitch Prime! We Twitch Prime. Ba -dum -bum 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 -bum. Is this? There's a ramp here. 50, 58? Okay, we are going over there eventually. Not yet. Have I been here? 61. We're definitely going into that area. 56. 50. This looks like it's men. Like I have to go here. Oh. Oh. That was cool. How do I get there? Dude, how do I. How did I not even see that? I feel so blind. It's like my caveman vision is only evolved to see like 2% of what's in front of me and everything else is just blurry. 
This has happened so many times at this point. Why are my genetics so bad? <laughs> Get glasses? I already use contacts. Thank you very much. They're minus 3.5. <laughs> If you don't know, if you don't use glasses or contacts, that's quite a lot. I'm quite blind without my contacts. This guy Sigma is, dude. Hi, Viet. Now there's gonna be people who have that one friend who have like minus four hundred. There's gonna be someone with a dad that has like minus one hundred and twenty-seven actually. So yeah, yeah, minus three point five. Might it might not be the most right? But it's still quite a lot. <laughs> this is what I'm saying. Never compare yourself, because with so many people, there's always going to be someone who has it. I mean, maybe, maybe you can. There's always going to be someone who has it worse, right? In the same way, there's probably someone who has it better as well. But you shouldn't really. I don't think it's a good like consolation. Whoa! Like, oh, at least I'm Which not the most blind person in the world. That doesn't really... That's not like, yay! <laughs> uh, no drop! No drop! Thank you for the one full year! I appreciate it a lot! Caught on Twitch and bottom fragger, thank you as well! Rolo Dej! So 57 was the one I needed. That's 58. There's one more, somewhere. Could it be through here? Yes. Yes, it could. Oh, so you just wanna... It's like my khaki map. I built this. I, I built this. I made this. This is mine. No, me? No, I built it. You built this too, chat? Well, I built it first. You can look at the flag to aim. I just saw that. You see that spinning flag thing? I just saw that. I was looking... I was trying to x-ray vision through the block. Like I was trying to visualize, oh, it's probably right about there. That's how I think about jump sometimes. I try to x-ray vision it. My minus 3.5. What is your fa favorite precedent? I uh, don't have a favorite precedent. You can ask me about prime ministers though. As I'm seeking to become one. Favorite prime minister has to be that British prime minister who set a new world record. The speedrunner. What's her name? <laughs> Truss? I mean, she set an incredible record. Like, how do you even beat that? It's like less than a day as PM. Incredible. Absolutely incredible. What is this track? Yeah, this is World of Wampus. Lentilium, the guy who made this, makes one like every half a year or so. 
100 checkpoints every time. Equally difficult every time. A lot of trial trial tricks you have to do. So it's it's a difficult map, but fun to beat. What musical instrument would you like to learn and why? I think, honestly, rather than an instrument, because I already play one instrument, I play piano, that's enough. What about just singing? Do you guys believe anyone can learn to sing? Can anyone learn to hit notes? Or are some people just not meant for it? Like, can you take a random person on the street, give them proper musical training by the world's best vocal coach? Would they be able to sing pretty well on a stage? Given enough practice, you know, whatever. Oh. That's kind of cool. Technically, no, not everyone has vocal cords. Okay, but let's say the average person. Because there's sometimes I want to sing along to a song and then I'm like, wait, maybe it's better if we just let the artist sing it. <laughs> maybe we should just let them sing their song and not have me ruin it. Uh, 58? Where's 59? Oh, it's up top. What? Oh, there's a ran- Does that help? Yes. JNX words? Yeah, they hurt. They hurt. They hit the right spots. <laughs> Ski ball. Isn't this Pac-Man? Some form of a Pac-Man? Or a Pac-Man? Favorite ancient wonder of the world? You know, it isn't really that hard to choose because most of them have crumbled. Except for the very best made ancient wonder of the world, which is, of course, the Great Pyramid of Egypt. I mean, you really have to be quite dishonest with yourself to pick anything else because they all crumbled or got griefed. Imagine making a Minecraft base so obscenely large that even if you don't like it, just the effort to grief it is not worth it. Like, why? Like, where do you even begin? You, you can't grief it. It is so hard to grief. That's the most impressive thing. There was a sultan or something in the- in- I, I don't remember when. Like 1200s? Who really wanted to destroy the pyramids? Because they were, you know... Whatever. Welcome to the vine. Imposture! Thank you for the gifted! Welcome to the vine. Thank you so much for the fire gifted! Yeah, there was a- there was a guy who wanted to grief the pyramids. But he quickly realized it was so futile. They're, they're, they're just- you can't. Oh no. Am I gonna be one of these streamers? You go into their chat and the first thing you see is just spinning fish. And there's- there's no like, event that prompts people to post Joel, they just post it. Like there's no... Cause and effect. There's no, like... <laughs> event that leads to it. It's just, oh. I'm a part of the chat, I will spam Joel. Is that what we're gonna become? I seize you, Joel, I spam Joel. <laughs> I think you have to... Oh, and then with a bug slide. I almost had the answer. So high up in this, you get a nice full speed line down there. Nice. 
to play in 12 minutes. So I already told chat, if you're just coming in for a couple today, or excited for it, uh, the policy we set for this is, if it's a grass map, if it's a dirt map, if it's tech, I will not play it. I will keep going on this. But since I'm not treating this run that religiously, if it's anything that isn't those, I would be happy to um, reset my run, play a couple of day, come back and do a good, good first run on the map. But if it's something like a f fourth gear grass map, I can pass. Bob's Woo! a couple of day again. Which Dude, they had Bob's three last the month. Day again. They had three bobs a couple of days in last month. I felt so good. I felt like I was actually good at the game. This guy's Sigma is no. Dude. I'm doing that wrong. Per Spellman, thank you so much for the sub. Also, that one guy, thank you. I think I see this, but I think I am just doing it wrong. Um, instead of trying to go around the circle, you just take... You take the bounce. Yeah, that's better, but still pretty bad. Woo! Which bra? But I mean, I'd be interested to hear what you guys think, regardless of the map. Let's say it's the best couple of day map ever, okay? Couple of the day map is super sick, full speed bobsleigh, whatever. Something I th I thrive on, something I enjoy, something that makes the streamer um, happy. Should I play it or should I just keep going on this and be miserable? <laughs> Do you want the sim character on the screen to be happy or miserable? Cause you know, like in the sim, in the Sims, if you don't make the character too happy, he will eventually uh, rebel. Oh, that was good. He will refuse to work if he doesn't like his job. I like my job. Wait, did that work? Oh, I see. Okay, hang on. I need the smallest touch from this. No! Wait. Wampus or deep dip? Uh, deep dip. Okay, one more. Woo! Which prong? Oh. Woo! Which prong? I blame you for my new track mania addiction. <laughs> Smiley face. <laughs> this car had no business surviving that. <laughs> Just restarts, it's free. Is it? I'm only like 10 away. I'm making so good progress. It's no steering. If you're this close to finishing. To the finish line of a marathon. You're just like, ah, I just do another attempt actually. Because I can do it faster. It's not that hard. There's not a marathon? What do you mean it's not? I'm three hours in and halfway. It's definitely a marathon. This guy's Sigma. Chesticle thing of a prime. Dude, this is the content I subscribe for. Also, this is nothing. If you're if you're if your ADHD TikTok brain is like, oh my god, I need something to happen. I once, when I played Trackmania blindfolded, just waited an hour on the grass 
because I thought my car was close to a checkpoint. I was like, yeah, I think my car's pretty close and it's gonna roll into the checkpoint. I'll just wait. Yeah, that was the content, just waiting. Look at us now. This is one minute. What, like, what? The entire distance that passed here is one minute. Now, um, I'm <laughs> noticing a different problem, which is uh, not so much getting past all the pillars, you see, but getting the car into the checkpoint. <laughs> uh, okay. Now, I think I know what I want to do here. This guy, Sigma, is... Yeah, a good. late air brake would also do so well. Okay, guys, you're gonna have to trust me on this. You're gonna have to trust me on this. What I want to do is go to the very end of the pipe, full speed off, late air brake, so the car kind of dances on the nose a bit, wobbly, and then uh, check me. That's what I want to do. Sometimes in life, we don't get everything we want, that's that would be great. Woo! Which bra? Let's see. Um, my 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 minus three point five is starting to get blurry. My vision. Uh, is that the edge? I think that's the edge. Okay. I yeah, need to time this. We need to time this. Not too early. Not too early. Not too early. Right about now. Heck, that's not good. Oh, we could crash this and yes. And now I need a very good third crash. Can that please do exactly what I want to? So I kind of spin as it tries to go around it. And just keep hooking the wheel. Hook the left wheel. No, no, wrong. Wrong way. Okay, let's try it again. Oh, that's not too bad. Oh, I have to be very careful with that. Uh, I like the first outcome the most, which was something like this. <laughs> Which this is a long cop. I lost bra? focus. The edging content I'm here for. Oh, this is very bad. Uh, well, I kind of have to try, right? This is not good. What might happen? The last out we have is crashing the front of that booster and, and it doing something. This is my final out. If this does not work, then... Uh... Yeah, yeah, it's doing something. What can I do with this, though? Okay, okay, hang on. In the last five weeks, you've played in 18 cups and finished top five in half of them. You're pretty good at this game, dude. Well, most of them are off stream. I don't know if you've Daily seen... Daily reminder to check if you have a prime. I don't know if you've seen that, but most of them are not on stream. I play worse when I stream. And I've noticed and I've become very self-conscious. Most of my good couple of the results lately are off stream. I don't know how to do to fix. It's, it's that, it's that, it's that. I'm so sorry, Chad. I tried to get that there. How do I fix it? Now I kind of want to play today just to see if I can do well on stream. Because it's been like a... Thanks for the reminder. I forgot I had a prime. Like a curse. I get like top five when I'm just chilling playing tech. I got top, top three on tech yesterday. Woo! No, not yesterday. Last time Which I played. Bra? Versus Barbos and Spam. On tech? I beat a bunch of good tech players. Then I go on stream and I troll Division 2 on a magnet troll map. 
Like what? Oh, is this gonna? Oh, that's not good. Oh, well, maybe. Which prime? Any primers? That might kill my car. It did not. Thank you. First of all, I just want to say I'm sorry. I did not know. And sometimes you can't really fault people if they did not know. It would be strange to blame someone for things they could not be aware of. Uh, that was beyond my comprehension, my intellectual ability. Uh, I apologize. Second of all, I don't. You were entertained. You were entertained. Woo! And I should never apologize if I'm entertaining. Uh, okay. Three minutes till we find out what couple today is. I said it's like a 50-50 we played or not. Don't get disappointed if I do. Don't get disappointed if I don't. It is just gonna be a spontaneous decision, okay? Depending on the map. Was there even a poll? Like, did the, did the people speak? I'm heavily invested. See, I think if we play it, a second run of this will feel less special. It will feel like the waiting moment to do all of it again. That's the one feeling that I don't like about doing a second run as my first run, you know what I mean? It's kind of like all this didn't matter. So I am leaning towards staying on this. Like, it would have to be a really good map. This guy is For me is to... Uh, Thank you for Abandon sharing your what we skill got going. of turning W's into L's with us. Thank you for supporting the, the W to L industry. <laughs> w to L Incorporated. But like, if it's a bobsleigh map, then I hope people will understand. And here, here's my worry too, and this might sound irrational, but I'm just gonna get out ahead of it. If I play couple today, and let's say I do badly, I will get so many comments like, bro, played couple today for this? Nah. <laughs> nah, little bro played couple today for Div 2? Nah. And then it's just, okay, well, I don't, maybe don't wanna do Giga Chad map? It looks pretty. It looks gorgeous. It looks stunning. But it also looks unwinnable. It looks unwinnable. You know who's going to win this? Barbos. Which prime? Yeah. Barbos or Loudus or Complex or Mawil or Spam or Scrappy or Granati or Masa or Lo. Do you want me to name every good attack player? Because I could, but. Yeah, the, 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 uh, I... and not only that, but look at the people that have records on this already. Lingo's played it, Aerosol's played it, AR Downs played it. It's a pass. It is a pass. Let's continue. Now we can really focus up because now I know I'm not missing out. So much today, but I still think it would be nice. Like, don't you shouldn't not play it just because I don't play it, but I'm not playing it. Woo! Which prime? Oh, I had a prime left. I hope you guys enjoy a couple today, but I will... I, I'm three hours in. Shout out to you, virtual. <laughs> 33 and Tarzan. going strong, homie. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Tier 3, even. Thank you. Come to Nepal and we shall climb Mount Everest together. I've seen you post that message several times. And while I appreciate the offer, that just seems like a bad idea. Woo! Which prime? Wait, Riddle Master! You said if I get Division 1, I didn't get Division 1! That's far too kind.
Thank you so, so much. Like, listen, I... This guy is I like nice. mountain hiking. Dude. Yeah. But if more it's dangerous... CLS, Viet PLS. If it borders on the line of dangerous more than cool, that's one thing. Woo! Twitch Prime! And then another thing We're that I hate when I mountain hike boys. is people. Oh my god, going on a crowded hike? Woo! When you don't even feel As like you're in nature? Of Wampus Wednesdays, this is a welcome sight. Why am I even outside if I'm gonna be walking in a this busy, crowded thinking. city street Dude. up the mountain? More money to you. Why do I even? Why do I even go out in nature? I'll just go down like Carl Johan in o Oslo. There's a there's a really cool mountain in Norway called um, Pulpit Rock. If you watched uh, one of the Mission Impossible movies, where there's like a fighting scene on a mountain, uh, it was filmed at Pulpit Rock. Really cool hike, but walking up there, you're just walking in a line. Same for another spot called the Troll's Tongue. Also beautiful view. You stand in a line at the top though for about three hours to get to go out on the plateau and have one picture. That's the... Uh, that's the... Uh, <laughs> The reality of, of hiking these cool, uh, cool places. You have to go really early if you want to avoid the, the, the queue. Lil bro skipped couple today for this. For, oh, I was gonna, I was gonna dunk on you, but I spared you. I don't think you would have recovered, Grindy. Like, that would have been a bit too much violence. What's the principle the UK has to always use minimal force necessary? What's that called? It's called something. To, on to only use minimal force, like... No, it's it's like a law thing. It's like a law principle. I don't know. Common law? A proportional response? I don't even know. What I'm saying is he made a joke and I would commit Twitch chat murder and it would not be appropriate. Earlier today, I did ban a viewer off stream. When I was not even live, I decided to ban a viewer. And that was, that was proportional force. He might open the stream at some point and then realize, oh. So it's over. And then I'll be like, yes. It is over. Your time has come. What did he do? Not that. <laughs> I actually did that. <laughs> he just kept doing that. Honestly. He just kept doing exactly that. And I just had to tell him to stop. Riddle Master, what's going on? Thank you for 50 gifted. I appreciate it. It's so annoying. More support. No, thank you. Seriously. No, so I, I think... So... Hear me out on this chat. If I tell you what he did, do you think it's gonna encourage more of or less of said behavior? Do you think it's gonna serve as like a warning? Like, oh, don't do this? Cause you don't get banned for random things. You never get banned for random things. 
But I feel like it's gonna be like, hee hee. That's the... So, yeah. <laughs> I guess it's time. Time to talk about it. There's this emote of a spinning fish. And I swear to God, no matter the context of any conversation, he just... <laughs> Every time. Bro has gifted more subs this month than a $27 billion company. <laughs> True. Riddle Master has uh, outdone Red Bull, and Red Bull can't believe they're gonna take this L. They should challenge me to another deep dip challenge. Ooh! Heck. On my way home from Bouldering, do you want a burger? I mean, I barely know her, but sure. But sure, yeah. <laughs> That's comedy. That's comedy. Say what you will, you might not like it, but that's comedy. A burger? I barely know her. You're right, I don't like it. Oh. It's just that last time I tried to be actually funny, several hours into a trial map, things went wrong. Things went very wrong. My life would be better if things don't go wrong so much. So, uh, yeah. How was a couple of days so far, chat? It's Are you enjoying fine. it? Is it a good map? Am I missing out? Barbos is first. <laughs> what? On a tech map? Dude, how? I'm so I'm so happy for him that he's finally doing well on tech. Oh, it's there? Oh. Farm and virtual. But it doesn't work if I say what. It only works if I say it with a certain tonality. Like, what and what are very different. It really is the intensity with which you say it that... that makes it come across. Uh, now then. I'm just scared how high he... actually wants me to... Jump. Wasn't there, um... A checkpoint somewhere here? Yeah, that one. Okay. Is this plastic? No. So I have to jump to this and then to that. And then there's the long checkpoint. We haven't even gotten there. You just saw it. You only saw the number. We're not there yet. We, we were not even close to it. How far backwards does this actually go? Not far enough. Um... Oh, 
up to the platform. Oh! Wait, is it? Is this magnet? Because then you would just jump to the side. I think that's it. You go up on this and then magnet. I'm going to try to do it with a side flip. Too fast. Are we there yet? No. No, we're not. But I think I can do a pretty good time on this, to be honest. So far, the map is not like crazy difficult. Like, it's hard. But no checkpoints have been like Woo! stupid difficult. Primus is where you at. And if that remains the case, I could try to go for a faster time on it. Um I don't like hunting like super difficult trial maps though. Oh almost. Chat where's couple today. Decided to skip it today because we're so far invested into this and the map wasn't uh, exactly what I wanted to play. I'm not gonna change anything now, it's all up to virtual. Wait, don't say that. It's up to the next may mayor to the side. Let's say this, let's say this, to keep the emote pool fresh. Here's this a new rule. Sigma is, dude. Every- Riddle underscore master gifted a tier one sub to official mittens. They Riddle have master, given 118 you. gift subs in the channel. Thank you, again. Woo! Let's say this, that has to be enough speed. Wait. No, no, hang on. That looked savable. Oh, I don't think it is. Unless you turtle? Can you turtle? Can you somehow turtle? Even then. <laughs> I think we respawn. Uh, sorry. Uh, what was I saying? That derailed my brain so hard. I. Yeah, emo. Okay, thank you, thank you. Jesus. Um, from now on, Intux added 10 emotes. The next person we elect adds 10, but has to remove 3. The only way he gets to add 10 is if he first removes 3. So. Continuously, we add new good ones and we remove the, the worst ones of the previous mayor, right? And if you do this enough times, I think the chat emotes end up beautiful. So you might want to get in your last spam. Final spam. With the fish friend. Oh, okay. Th 65. Easy way to get the magnet? I'll have to see, uh... I have to see that after. Remove three, add seven new, and three old back. This guy's sick. I don't think there should be any good. rule about adding good emotes evening. back. At what age would you consider getting kids? This guy's Just as an outline, good. like 30, Hi, Joel. seems like a good age to get kids. Maybe it's not, maybe it's too early. I don't know how soon I'll hit 30. And I feel like, whoa, hell, I'm 30. But I also don't want to be like a super old parent if I get kids. I have friends though that are 23 and they have kids. Which seems crazy to me. But they're happy, so... <laughs> I 
I also need to be like... In shape enough mentally when I get a kid, right? So that I can train them for the Trackmania dad tournament. Like, I don't want to get kids and then not rigorously practice with them every day for a Trackmania dad tournament. So it's like... <laughs> That's a must. So if I'm like 40, I might not bother anymore. We can't have that. Thirty-five. My son is as old as my sub. Oh, congratulations, Zach! Do you want kids chat? If you're like me, you're like early twenties or teenager, or do you just not want to bother? I think it's both. It's definitely both, right? It's both a lot of time. An effort this committed. Is, it's dude. like having a pet, but on steroids. Um, but it's probably also like very um, giving. I would hope. I would hope it's not only only bad. Rewarding, yeah. Also, like, what are you gonna fill your years with? That's what I'm thinking. I'm being honest. What the hell am I doing when I'm, like, 40 anyways? Am I still gonna play Trackmania? Am I just gonna play Trackmania for 70 years? That doesn't seem like life. Like the Twitch emote life. Okay, I, I don't have to quit Trackmania, right? But only that? Good harvest, thank thank you. The checkpoint's hard. Unless I'm doing it wrong, like too much speed. Have I finished college? No. <laughs> Not even close. Didn't even start. Just become plugged into Trackmania like the Matrix. Become the car. Ooh. I mean, it doesn't seem so bad. I think I need to be slower though. Because I think if you're slow enough, you can jump through the hole and still plastic bounce. I think like if I ever expand on what I do now, if I ever get bored of it, right? Which I'm not, but it would be Woo! like, let's say in like, I don't know, five, six you years. Brought me back to TM again. Thanks, I mate. think what I want to do Good is try to create something like as evergreen as possible. Something that will last. Something like a bit of a pyramid, but in content format, you know? The, the pyramids are 3,500 years old and we still talk about them. Why? Because they're very impressive. Or very profound. Or very mysterious, but they have a lot of factors that keep people interested. Centuries later. What if you make a piece of art like that? Right? Like a video, or a movie, documentary, a book. Nobody reads books. A documentary, probably, about something. I started reading a book, actually. I know, I mean, it's like, not a lot of people read books anymore. But here, here's a, here's a, here's a, here's a, I feel like people who read books judge people who read audiobooks. Would you say it's not the same? It's like, oh, you don't read books. You just listen to a podcast. That's not reading. 
What would you like to be doing if YouTube or Twitch didn't work out? Uh, for a while I wanted to be a musical composer for movies. Like soundtracks and shit. But then I realized that wasn't really gonna go anywhere. Um, growing up I thought I wanted to be a scientist, but then I realized that requires a lot of smart. And a lot of math. <laughs> Then I was like, nah. I think... Let's try this this content thing. Let me know if you're on easy backseat. I think I'm just too fast, yeah. I think I'm just... Too fast for the jump. I think so. It's like... Audiobooks, right? Let's, let's say we, we read the same book. We get the same information. I would say like if you say, oh, I haven't read The Hunger Games, but I watched the movie. Okay, that's a bit different because there's a lot of things they'd have to cut in the, in the movie that, you know, are in the book. But audiobook and book are the same. It's just different format. 66. I'm scared. Like, what difference does it make if my distracted brain looks at the page on the paper, or like, just listens? I will say... This might be the hardest checkpoint. Because it looked daunting when we saw it from above. It was... No, it was left there. Full speed across, like 800 speed and jump up. But at least the start is press forward. An abridged audiobook may cut content from the original published book. Yes. Aren't there also just abridged versions of regular books? This is hard on keyboard. So an abridged version of a book would be the same as the abridged audiobook. Wait, I need to see. We need a- we need a map. Oh, left. Oh, not slide- this is like 700 knots sliding out? Okay. You're waffling. Here's the one argument for the book, okay? And this is sometimes important in storytelling. Because you're holding the book... ...in your hands, and you can feel... ...that you are running out of pages. Like, the story is reaching a conclusion. Yeah. It can be very hard to, like, have a surprise ending. A movie can kind of have a surprise- Oh, it's over. The book, you know you're on the last page. You kind of- you kind of- You can't really twist like that in a book. Progress bar? Well, if you watch movies with the progress bar, I don't know what to tell you. My argument stands. This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Hey, -o. Like, you will feel physically when you read a book that this the story Sigma is ending. Is, That's what I felt when I read books, when I was a book reader. Ah! Almost. Because you feel less pages in your hand? Yes. And because at every moment when I flip a page, I will think, oh, now I'm like, oh, there's only this much left. What's gonna happen? It's still exciting. It's not bad, but it's just... With an audiobook that you listen to, you wouldn't know. Or with a movie. Book should have a hundred blank pages at the end. That would actually be great. No, that see that would be great. Like, have you ever watched a TM like a esport vod on YouTube, right? 
And you see like one team being up 2-0. And, oh, and there's 10 minutes left of the video. It's like, you know there's no comeback happening. You know which team is going to win. You're already spoiled by the fact that there's no dead space at the end of the video. If you can relate to that struggle in a video format, why not book format? It's the same problem. There's not enough time for the hero to rescue the princess. It's it's over. I think... Wait, so... So this? Oh, that's... Ma yeah. Magnet there. And then up. Oh my god. The solution is to read erotic literature because it isn't linear. You have to go back and forth to read the book for it to make any sense. What? Ergotic. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Ergotic. I haven't heard of ergotic literature. <laughs> I mean, hey, he could have been right. Just read erotic literature. It's not a problem. You're done before the book is. So it's not a pr you're not, you're not going to run out of pages. <laughs> it's like, yeah. Maybe that's you what he wants. Cool. Could I rate your vibe? Or do you have a vibrator already? I do not have a vibrator, no. Feel free to rate the vibe. Live update book. Because updates are so good. Imagine you're reading a book, a nice book that's a perfectly functioning book, and then every now and then they just put driver updates. Hey, we made the book better. What? But it was working. No, 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 this is a great quality of life improvement for your book. You mean like the Bible? Well, the... <sighs> yes. <laughs> But I feel like they have locked themselves into a corner, right? Because they have the Old Testament and the New Testament. And they can't really say like, oh, sorry, that's not cool anymore. Okay, well, here's the New and New Testament. Like they have kind of said, okay, this is the last one though. They do that all the time, really? Renewed Testament. Ooh. Could work. That's huge. Nice. The New Testament can be boiled down to five words. Be excellent to each other. I don't think that's what it said. Or they wouldn't have to update it. Okay. Well, anyways, up to 68. Where to? Is this magnet? I... Th well, would that really achieve anything? No. It wouldn't. Oh, no, I see. I have to use this. That's very far, though. This could be a hard checkpoint. Favorite checkpoint so far? There's some really, like, clever puzzle ones. I don't know the numbers of them, but... This was one of the coolest ones so far. Okay, what I think you have to do here is... Uh, use this thing? Didn't see that. <laughs> I 
Like, what is all this? 69, okay. What? Oh, you dropped through. That's why it's there. Okay. It's not part of the attack point. Uh... Wait, oh. Think I just saw it? Magnet eat? Maybe? That does not look intended. And it's quite far. But what's the alternative? You can't really... No, I'm stupid. <laughs> I'm, I just saw it. <laughs> Sometimes, and it's actually turning out to be quite a lot of the time, I just... I'm blind. It's starting to become a problem. <laughs> Oh, maybe it's magnet eat. Wait, I think you have to go on this ledge. It's right there? Did you guys know? I once got fourth place in a pathfinding competition. And it was on a map like this, like an obstacle map. But what I did... What I did, right? Is I found some of the checkpoints myself, and then I got stuck on one. But this is on a server. So I waited till someone got to my checkpoint. And then when they did, I just copied everything they did. Now, I was out of like 20 people or something like that. I just copied everything they did and followed them all the way to the finish. Because I recognized I can't win by finding it myself, but I can just copy you. So every time you guys say like copy world record as a strat, it's not a bad idea. Plastic. This guy has Sigma is plastic. Dude. Ban plastic. Enough is enough. At least I know it's plastic. Our Heminator, thank you so much for the prime. But regular sub. Appreciate it. Uh just gotta get past that. That booster. The start of this gets me excited for Khaki again. I have to validate my Khaki map soon. I built a Khaki map on stream like a week ago. And uh, <laughs> it might need some changes. But I want to Valley at least one for this next event. Oh, that looks good. Nice. Thinking maybe take this with a good respawn. Alright, are you ready, chat? Not yet. I don't want anyone to fire too early. We're on checkpoint 68. This requires some self-discipline. We are almost there, but you gotta hold your horses. You gotta hold your horses. We're almost there. The longer you hold, the better the payoff. Almost there. Hold. Hold. <laughs> R 
release. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, that is a lot. We got to checkpoint Woo! 69. Very nice. Very nice. Woo! Twitch Prime! Number. <laughs> Enjoy the moment, chat. Oh. Let me see. I got to my fridge. Woo! Yes. Twitch oh. Prime! I got some juice at the store as well. Like, I came and prepared for this run. I really just got Whoa. everything that I needed Twitch to sustain myself. So, I'm feeling great. I'm feeling amazing. Like, you can't really do such a long run without preparation. Sorry about plastic sounds. Nice. I also got these. This is like, it's called lefsa. It's a Norwegian snack. You have cinnamon in the middle. This guy's sick. And they're very soft. Dude. They're Love very your nice. content and you. Thanks, smile. It's not Coke, no, it says, well, Woo! so I got one water. Ha, the funny number. And then, now I got juice. Right there. They Woo! look uh, similar, but Which similar prime? manufacturer. But they taste different. Woo! Which prime? Fire, Just thanks so much. Nice. Demon Heaven, Locky. Kilo, Adobes, Araku, call me Locky as well. Thank you guys for the primes, everybody. Do you have enough water or do you want one with your burger? I could have some water with the burger. One second. All right. Let's continue. We got 31 checkpoints left. Cool scenery. This is 70. Wait, that's 98. That's almost the end. 96, 97, okay. Here. Does this lead me to... Oh, there it is. Alright, let's go. You love Trials, Juliano? Me too. Especially Trials, where a big portion of the chat has seen another streamer play it and give me advice every single checkpoint. <laughs> it makes the trial experience so much better. <laughs> it's like, damn. Will you see the statement? Yes. Is this enough speed? To go... Well... Where? Just in between any of them, okay. First playthrough, it's kind of my... First and a half. Because I had to restart a few times because of lags. I'm from Norway too. Oh my god. That's crazy. We have our country in common. Chat. I'm from Earth. I'm from Earth. It's. Uh, you too? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Oh, it's cool to see Norwegians in my stream. Twitch bra. School. We need more Norwegian people to start playing Trackmania. I want to see a Div 1 look like 
a skiing competition where it's only Norwegians and like one Swede. Make it happen. Start grinding. Maybe a Finn as well, okay? Maybe one Finnish skier. You do that in Norway, that'll be cool. Austrians really mad. Okay, so I haven't been following skiing ever since Norway started dominating totally like five, six years ago. So I don't know what the situation is. I just know they win too much. But still the same, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Just don't use lip balm. But hey, it's legal. Little bit of lip balm. I don't see any problem with that. Of course you wouldn't. You're the 34% guy. I hope you guys realize chat, you've conditioned me in such a way that if I ever say something, I will immediately think, what will the chat respond to use what I said against me? There's there's part of my psyche now is an uh, internal voice that only seeks to argue with literally things that haven't been said yet, but that will be said. It's so crazy, like... It, it, there are voices. It's like, what would chat say to this? Oh, they would say this, okay, then I'm prepared. I'm one step ahead of you. I already know everything you're about to say. Barbo's one couple today. Okay, can you just clip what I, what I said earlier, like 45 minutes ago? It is, it is not a surprise, but it, it makes for a good YouTube short. Woo! Twitch prank! Hey. Is this engine off? It is. The bugs are under the skin, yes. Oh. Whoa. We're not real, we're all in your head. Bad. You can't first gaslight me exactly like a human would and then pretend you're AI. What if I'm not the real one? Have you guys ever considered that? What if I'm the fake one? You know, I wonder when AI Woo! gets to the point where Fish you could watch a stream. Six months hypers. And then only like half a year into watching that channel, you find out like, wait, they're AI? W welcome to the vibe. That'd be absurd. <laughs> welcome to the vibe. That'd be crazy. You've saved up so many this channel points in that channel, you. Dude. Hi, gifted you? so many subs to a robot? What? Thank you, Imposter, for the five gifted. You know what's changed? Here's what's changed. If I watched a video, for example, two years ago, of um, the Chinese president. What's what's this? What's he called? Chinese president. Uh, Winnie the Pooh guy. If I watched a video of Xi Jinping saying "What's up, Beijing?" two years ago, I'll be like, "Yes, haha, <laughs> funny. That's real." If that video was published today, I'd be like, "Damn, lazy AI edit, right?" I no longer trust any video with what looks like a human saying something in it. Minus 3 million credit score. Well, it's true. Any any video I see now, I no longer trust it as a basis. Like I think, oh, that can't be real. Probably AI.
That's an AI language model I can't comment. Like, sometimes I will have to look at the date of a video to know it's real. Like, oh, this was uploaded pre-AI era, it's real. Somebody won. You've done that? Yeah. Uh, was that forced acceleration? I think so. Up there? Okay, so that's a late? And then no style for a plastic bounce 360 into the wall, right? You guys saw that too, right? AI is a lot older than people think. Is that like when people say... Actually, the first computer was invented in the 1920s. Actually, the internet is not old at all. It's been around since 1964. And then it's like the internet as we know it Whoa. literally just spawned. Which Technically, the internet was created in 1647 when the Greek emperor, like... I don't like that stuff. No matter how correct it is, I just don't like it. I don't know why. I don't know why I'm so argumentative about things like that. I should just let go. It doesn't matter. Triggered by facts. But facts doesn't need to be a personality. It doesn't need to be a personality. You can know cool things without... It being like an entire like. What is it called? I don't know. Like the triangles and no, the triangles. You can make a personality about hating one specific movie from a very popular and well renowned director. And the pyramids of Egypt. You can make a pretty good personality based on those two things. It's true. No, it's just true. We still haven't talked about Tenet yet, this trial. Is it time? <laughs> Shall we, gentlemen? There's an Instagram account. It's called Trackmania Pro Tips. Someone tagged me in their post. Because Trackmania Pro Tips posted on Instagram, Tenet is a good movie. Which means there's one of you. There's one of you out there who runs an account for Trackmania Tips who decided to be a little bit funny. Didn't dare to be it on your main though. Not on your main account. I'd just like to know who it was. Uh, no. Bro, look at the map again. Yeah, I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. Switch bra. Is it? Reminder to oh, hydrate properly. Having 2% too little water in you will already cause a drop in focus. Also sub with prime. 2%? Damn, I better have some water real quick. <laughs> oh no, that's the juice. <laughs> well, juice is good for you. Please focus on the track and stop talking about Tenet Kek. You know what? I should move on. Ultimately, 
I can only enjoy what I enjoy and you can only enjoy what you enjoy, chat. I'm not trying to shame you for liking a movie. I'm not trying to say you're wrong. My trifle really just comes down to the director himself. But you don't need to hear that. Shall we play the game now? Can it be a direct jump straight up? Maybe. I think it's uh, the plastic though. We'll see. Let's finish this in under six hours. Try to. Is that possible? That was it? It wasn't. I don't think it was. You need like a specific plastic bounce. Like this won't get there. Oh god. I didn't know it was forced acceleration. Okay, that was good. Okay, my eyes are not deceiving me. <laughs> nice. Oh my god, it was really that hard. Well, it was kind of hard, okay? It's precise to aim that. I don't know. Okay, I, I, I aimed for the L. And I took it. It was not there. 73. Uh, pipe. Where is it? No, you probably have to reuse this. Right? Lancillion loves reusing parts. Twenty. Twenty. I don't even see where to go. 99? Oh my god. <laughs> uh... Is it a reuse? No. I don't think so. What's this area? Uh, I think I just was here, yeah. 100. I keep going back to the same places. What's over here? I've been here. I've been here, I've been here. I just don't know. It's not further up, is it? Like, he's at the build limit here, I think. Let me just drive and see what's natural. Okay, so you spawn pointing this way. Like, does make sense to kind of leave around there? Could there be something where you drive all the way down? Uh, this? 87. Wait, dude, didn't I at the start? Is it here now? 85? 82? This looks 81. We're going internal ramps, I think. 79. Wait a second. 83? Maybe not quite yet. 
Yeah, it's like 78. Wait, so 78 is the drop in? Is that it? And you drop from where? I've been on this one. Wasn't this a high attack point? 86. I don't know where it's at. 22? If I can figure out how you get into the pyramid, I'll know where I need to be. Then you'd likely jump into it, right? You've used this. Where am I? Oh, okay. Uh, 73! Huh? Oh. Am I bad for not fighting that? This is the next one. I have to aim for that from up here. Okay. Well, I'm, okay. Well, I'm just I'm just garbage. And you know what garbage does, chat? Garbage camp. There is no way this is intended. This is an awful jump. I guess you don't really need to... You can just go here, right? How close is this? Almost. About like three blocks? Yeah, do that with a bit less. Ta-da! Sorry, sorry, really sorry. I'm so- I said sorry! I said sorry! <laughs> they were in the way! No, no, no. Oh? Hang on, that was pretty good. What about this? Target locked. Target locked. That was very good. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh my god, there was a pipe? No, bro. No. There was a pipe that you all wanted me to use and I didn't want to use it just to spite you for telling me to use it and I did it my own way? Oh no. What a shame. <laughs> I would have had so much more fun if I did it the boring pipe way instead of my cool alternative. It's not trolling, because it's good for you. It's it's more fun. This guy's Sigma is it's a healthy amount of trolling. I found a beautiful piano song for you, Viet. A beautiful piano song? Feel free to link it. I don't think we're gonna listen to it right now, because I'm in I'm in my hype playlist. You can also post it in the Discord. Thank you so much, Numix. Mix. 
Good for engagement. See, that clip will do well too. I'm a farmer tending to my crops. Still on rails. Two years later. Oh, that seems aw awfully fast. It's in the Discord? Okay. I'll check it out. Rails. Feel strong, man. Oh, maybe. Okay, I will say there's one thing I'm very bad at in this game. It is wet plastic. There are people that are good at this. I am not one of them. It is the most slippery thing you can drive on. And you need very smooth steering to have full control. And on keyboard, that is not that easy. It's not easy regardless, but yeah. Looks like a little more than 50. 52 maybe? Oh, 55 or so. Just a little bit. Oh. Can I, like, choose the successor to the right? It the And not to discriminate, but it depends on who. <laughs> it's like, if you choose someone good, then yes. If you choose someone bad, then no. <laughs> if you say like, oh, I think Buckley should choose the emotes, I will say no. I'll be the decider. Okay, okay. Well, who wants to select seven new 70 V modes and remove three? You get to be the mayor of 70 V for a little bit, but you have to resign your rights. Hatchet 302. Hatchet is the inheritor. A long time viewer. I'm biased. I will always be biased towards the OG viewers. I'm openly biased. Besides, Hatchet just became a dad, so he knows what emotes you kids will enjoy. He's got that that father mindset going. Perfect for my target audience. <laughs> I swear, every time when we're out walking, and when this happens, Janik just starts laughing at me, and I don't know what to do. There'll be like, like a kid. Probably no more than like six or seven. Going like, excuse me, are you are you a YouTuber? And it's crazy. It's like average version of you. <laughs> Eight years old. <laughs> it's very sweet. But it's also like I know not all of you guys are children. Not all of you guys, okay? You're adult human beings that I'm talking to. Like when someone says div2 streamer, I know that I'm not just getting like rolled by an eight year old. Cause if it if I if I'm sitting here wasting mental energy arguing with kids, with children who should be in school or doing their homework. All of these technologies, if you are You should probably... Okay, well, so... Okay. My argument is... First of all, glad you're enjoying the game. I also started playing at a young age. But I also learned my manners. I also respected my elders. I also knew that... I was young and dumb and naive. Okay? And that boomers like this virtual guy could teach you a few things.
I am becoming older. It is what it is. Reminds me of falling on deep dip on that wet, wet wheels one. Yeah. Oh, heck. Sorry, children. That was not necessary. Or maybe it was- how? Weird. It's either a lot more speed or a lot less. Woo! To get grip. Joel. I had hope. <laughs> I had My wife says you're nice. She likes your Norwegian attitude, even though you don't like sweets. How many times must I say that I like sweets before you guys believe me? You guys think I actually hate the sweets? This guy Sigma is... Dude. This has been a great joy to follow during my work from home shift. Like, I literally hate Sweden. The country closest to us. People who speak relatively the same language. People that share the same values, just not the same amount of Winter Olympic medals. Like, these people are quite similar to us. They're just a little bit worse at skiing. And they have a little bit less money because they don't have oil. You know, it's like, we're very similar countries. They're just like a little bit worse in every regard. I don't hate them, okay? I don't hate them whatsoever. Like, we're basically the same, we're just a little bit better, in every sense. That- that's the only thing. Did I lie? <laughs> Sorry. Proud of your fossil fuels? Not necessarily, but I think Norway did the right thing. Compared to a country like... Saudi Arabia or Qatar or whatever that instead of just using their immense wealth in the moment they just invested everything they earned into the stock market and you can look up how much the Norwegian oil fund is worth so money invested uh, from what they gain in oil is worth and it's like 14 trillion kroner which ends up at about 1.x trillion dollars right now which makes Norway have a really good welfare. Like, Norway Woo! owns like 2% of the stock market in top 500 companies. It's pretty obscene. Ooh. Reset and then what? I don't understand. Oh, is it there? Which yes. What does reset do? So you have a fragile block here, which makes every landing so that your car takes a lot of damage uh, and becomes uncontrollable. Reset just gets rid of this that debuff. Is, dude. Good luck, Wurcher guy. Patrick, thank you so much. <laughs> As a Dane, I am glad you keep beefing with Sweden to distract them so Denmark can swoop in and reclaim our lost land. 
Skåne. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's happening, Denmark. I'm sorry. It's too late. What is done is done. Who wants Skåne? Well, Denmark seems very pressed about it. All the more reason to not give them Skåne. <laughs> That should work if it bounces. Oh, I mean, okay. These are recoverable. Please take Scorner. I beg you. But what you need is like a climb that tilts the car. Is it worth it? Oh. We don't want Scorner. Sweden touched it, so now it's stinky. <laughs> Neither country wants Skolna. Yeah, I don't think we try. I think we just respawn. Just a really high jump that hits... Yeah, TTS had scored that in amazingly well. When does my term as mayor start? I don't have all day as my wife is in early labor at the moment. Right now! Oh shit! Okay, mayor! We <laughs> we need your services at the moment. Okay, you, you probably should have better things to do, Hatchet. But, 7TV, uh, uh, hey, one second. Emotes, uh... Add editor. Hatchet 302. Modify emotes. Save. Okay, you're in. Mr. Mayor, the floor is yours. The Twitch emotes must come before your wife. Of course, it's an important job. <laughs> so you can add seven and remove three. It's a bit of a fishy business. It requires a lot of uh, skill to remove the right emotes. The ones that don't contribute to chat that much. The ones that add no conversational value. <laughs> You really gotta see deep within yourself to find out which ones to remove. Why is everyone talking about you, Joel? You happen to share the name with the celebrity fish in chat. Perhaps the most famous fish in the world. I'm trying, I'm trying, Jacuzzi. Thank you so much for the two months. I'm just trying to think, is there any name that you kind of got before a character from a movie and now it's super annoying? Like, oh my god, you're named Elsa, like the, like the Disney princess. It's like, no, my parents just got me an order, ordinary ass Norwegian name. Alexa has to be super annoying. Karen? Karen is probably the worst. Joel is one of them. My name is Luke, never been able to escape Star Wars. You just gotta embrace it at that point. Siri? I know there was when um, Game of Thrones was hype. Imagine having the name Jeffrey Epstein. Imagine. 
Why would I imagine that? <laughs> it's a bit the name Wordual is kinda cringe nowadays. Nah. I mean, what if I name my kid Virtual TV? Would that be more appropriate? Like, who would name their kid after a second channel, am I right? Name it after the main. If you get named Virtual Vods, though, that's when you know, like, okay. I am not the favorite child. <laughs> but they still love me, just in a different way. There's a get. You did not have to! Plant! I'll follow the light. Is it savable? I feel betrayed. And we have our first emote. Amogus. That is very saucy. Woo! Switch bra! I'd say a pretty fine choice for the first emote. Can you believe someone just sat down and animated that one? It's like, yeah, you know what I'll do? While it's not my IRL name directly, my online nickname I still have today and Ubisoft sold platform name. I had it first, guys. You play. True. Have you guys been able to get your Discord names? Like, with the Discord name change thing? Because I was so worried that what would happen is someone would just cop mine and then try to sell it to me and be really annoying. But I got the notification like the other day and I could still claim mine. So I still got my, my OG. Which feels good. Small victory. Is it down here? Yes, it is. Seven. It's based on who Woo! had the name first. I thought it was just based on your account age. Like, you'll get asked to, or prompted to change the older your account is, and you can pick whatever. Jolly Bob, think of the Prime! They reverse names? Reserve. Ah! Okay. This takes forever? Well, it's a hard map. Most people spend several hours on their first go. <laughs> I'm actually playing it pretty fast for a first one. Woo! Twitch Prime! Two ND month of subs after a year Believe of watching. Doubt. Godspeed. I've been at it. 77? Dink. Next one. Oh, I hear the sounds of a burger. Brought to the room with love. Hello, Jamie. Oh. It's account Hi. age plus if Hi. slash since when you have nitro. Stuff for also, you. You partners and stuff? Discord Water staff and got first food? dips. Right, so I see they forgot to actually label that in the store, so I mean... Uh, of course. Um, now, I, I, you remember that I, um was in your car and I said, damn, that is like a water bottle that we said we would remove. Oh, yes? Yeah? So when I was driving today, I do a turn and I just hear <laughs> cling, cling, cling from the back seat and I'm like, was it my around. Was it my chain? Was it my chain on the back? Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. My diamond chain? This guy is trying to hide the trash under the back seat because we said we weren't gonna leave drinks in the car anymore. 
<laughs> I can explain. Mm -hmm. oh, so it looks like, looks like that's about it. Oh wait, wait, the water bottle is wet now though. Yeah, there's a little bit of condensation. I think we, I think we saved it. You see that this is clearly water. Um, and more water. water. You barely know her. I barely know her. Anyways, um, yeah, I had a good workout. I'm gonna go take a shower. So I'll that's good. It. 77 checkpoints, four and a half. That's pretty good pace. That is, uh, bar the resets. Bar the resets. Did you have a good climb? Climb I session. Did. That's nice. Are you are you fully gassed out now? I'm pretty. I don't know. I can still do. Want to try? Oh, I just did a full climbing. Session. Yeah, I know. I know. For the Remember fans. Remember socks, Schnick. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. My underarms hurt so much. Like, dude, that's more than I can do if I full Ooh. try. I think I could try as well, but I don't know. Last time I could peak at seven. I haven't worked out. Let's go. One. What? Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Can you PB? Hey, let's go. Oh, that's Eight and a half. Eight and a half. Still good. Ooh. PB material. Close. Very clean. A couple of fake ones, but still pretty good. Anyways, I'm uh, I'm going downstairs again. High five. High five. You didn't even let me grab it. <laughs> I'll see you later. Still zero. Chat, you guys will say that. It's like, oh, not proper form. We are literally bonking the roof. It's not ideal because you can't get up over the bar. You hit here. Technically, that wasn't a real pull-up because you didn't activate the third muscle group in the upper bicep. It's like, what the hell? I'm still pulling my body. It's still a workout. <laughs> Woo! Twitch Prime! Thank you for the compliment. That was very rude of me. <laughs> I was trying to make it weird by saying you look pretty good. You were attempting to make it weird. Okay, well, I made it even worse. At 77. 77. Out of 100. Four hours in. You're addicted. Make feel good. Well, I'm glad I like the game. Let's finish this thing. What is this? So this is World of Wampus. A 100 checkpoint... Trial slash adventure map with a lot of difficult obstacles. Which prize? And um, a map a lot of players, including myself, seek to finish. I have to go top of the pyramid. Panda think of the six months. This is the sixth and most recent Wampus map. But playing this one makes me feel like I should, at some point, revisit the old ones. Dude, that's a far jump. Does it have internal ramps? It does have internal ramps! Wait, reactor up? Is that good or bad? I don't think it's good. No, you have to- well, you want me to get reactor down. And then just a drift. Now I'm fast. And the aim? Maybe, 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 maybe. You're doing the first World Wampus? Checkpoint 70, pain? I should really revisit the first ones. There's six of these maps. But yeah. Woo! Twitch Prime! Virtual and chat not prepared for this emote? How many have you added now? Hatch it. Like, feel you think of the prime. Virtual pyramid? <laughs> That's me on the pyramid. 
That's just, wow. That's fantastic. Who made that? I want to VIP them. Figuratively and not literally because I'm low on VIP spots. Are the first ones possible physicians? I hope so. I think they are. I think they were updated. <laughs> that must be the best emote I've ever seen. Foy and Nuts as well and Track Road and Nani think for the 47 months. And new Allah, I didn't see you rated. Thank you so much as well. We had a good stream. It was right in the middle of fixing a camera. Or pull-ups, I can't remember. Wait, what did you take away? Wait, he took away the pyramid emote? See, I've told... I've told... My editors, but they don't understand. People like the pyramids. It's not even cap. Like, you guys like the pyramids. You like the pyramid topic. Would you guys enjoy the stream more if we never spoke about the pyramids again? Because I don't think so. I really don't think so. And I'm, I'm, I'm telling Buckley, the more you try to avoid having pyramids in any virtual TV video, the more people are going to ask about it. Why do you have beef Which with problem? a 3,000-year-old world monument? Is awesome. How do you- how do you have beef with a... pile of rocks from 3,000 years ago? Bro said same IQ. <laughs> this is okay. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> you have the same IQ as the pyramids of Egypt. That is... Guys, I have a question. What does bricked up mean? If you are bricked up about something. What does that mean? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Woo! Okay. <laughs> I, I figured, but I just want to make sure. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> People keep tagging me in a meme. And it's like this pimp outside the pyramids of Giza. And the text is, Damn, you got me feeling like a pyramid. The way I'm bricked up for no reason. I just wanted to have the proper context. <laughs> I've gotten tagged in that like five times yesterday. It's like bricked up. Is that like a bad motion? Like, no, okay, yeah, no, it's probably, yep. Yep, indeed. Uh, where do we go? That teleported. That checkpoint, I swear to God, it either teleported or it was not visible. I will not believe that. Was <laughs> I don't believe it. It can't have been in my field of view. Okay, here. Onto the wall. Bumper to here, bumper to there. It's small, you can easily miss that. Yeah, true. But I felt so blind today, Spike. I 
I felt very blind. As someone who had their dream vacation as a kid and laid down in Khufu's sarcophagus, your pyramid talks are super interesting. You scared the ass out of other visitors when you sat up. Sounds like a dream to me. Hypothetically. Are you guys with me in entertaining and hypothetical? Hypothetical. Hypotheticals are fun because we don't have to act them out, we can just talk about them. So hypothetically, if I were to pass away, which I will one day, and I wanted my burial ceremony to be similar to that of ancient Egyptian pharaohs, um, how much would that cost? Hypothetically. If I wanted a sarcophagus, if I wanted a miniature pyramid instead of a gravestone. And how much of this do you think my relatives would actually act out? It's like, is he, does he really want the pyramid though? Does he really want it to say ended with an L on his gravestone? Like, are you sure? Is that what he wrote? <laughs> I'm on a magnet and I don't know where to go. Aha. Uh -huh. So I just... Yes, and then... Looks like that bottom thing. Oh dear. Oh my god. Has anyone addressed the hair? No one has talked about the hair. No one whatsoever. E-boy Uvu. Just a little bit. A little bit E-boy. But I'll, I'll have you know, I see even the most like normie people that are like Young my age, they all have this haircut. I'm one of the sheep. I'm blending in with the herd. They won't know I'm a gamer now when I go outside. I've lost it. Young and my age choose one. <laughs> That's not a false statement. If they jump off a cliff, you do it as well. Now I'm like a like a sigma sheep. I'm a sheep that chooses not to be defined by the the hierarchy of society. Like I'm I am a sheep, but I'm also outside of the hierarchy at the same time. So you got like, you got like alphas and betas, right? But then you got sigma. Not to be confused with sigma, which is quite different. Or ligma, but sigma. That's where you'll find me. Different. So quirky and unique. And random. Like, just everything at once. 
We got to 81. When Womp is checkpointless? Yeah, I think if you did and you didn't change anything, it would be very shortcutable. Because in the start of the map, you're already close to checkpoint 50. I don't know if you can get there. You probably can. And at that point, you are skipping a lot. Where am I going? Oh, what's to the right? I remember that the second I saw it. Dude, we should be... These are short checkpoints. I think we're finishing this within 20 minutes. Within 20. Can you explain how they moved the stone blocks to the top along this three... Track 3,000 years ago? Well, what's impressive here, right? In this pyramid is that the roof does not collapse over the internal structure. Uh, there have been pyramids in Egypt that did collapse. This so called Sigma failed pyramids, right? Weird. Thank you for creating fun for other people and not making it about the money. You are the best. I try. But really, it's not about the fun, it's not about the money, it's about the pyramids. You know? It's not about... <laughs> It's just a cover, so I can talk about my favorite structures. But now some of the older Egyptian pyramids did fail. Just like this one probably would have failed. And so what's amazing about the Great One is the it's the biggest building product they ever undertook. And um, it still stands. Comprised of over 2.2 million individual stones. It's kind of insane. 2.2 million blocks of stone. That all had to be carved and cut and carefully placed. Of course, only the visible, like... The, the visible ones carved very precisely, the middle ones not so much, but still. And then for whatever reason, as if that wasn't hard enough, they were like, you know what? This middle part, right above where the king is at, you know what we need? We need massive granite blocks. Massive. I'm talking 70,000 kilogram blocks of stone. That they wanted to lift like 50 meters up into the pyramid. Why? What for? We know they thought granite was a, was a cooler rock, and it probably was, than limestone, which is what the pyramid mostly is made of. But like, why? What could humans possibly gain from carrying granite? Woo! And how do they do it? Stop it. That's what people should have told the Egyptians, but they didn't. They've chased their dream, carrying, carrying granite all the way up above the king's chamber. And that's why we still talk about them. Whew. Continue. <laughs> so... The best theories, right, for, for how they did it is, I would say, the internal ramp. And if you look at the Grand Gallery, it does, in my opinion, look quite a lot like a sort of pulley system. But it's under. It's placed underneath the Grand Gallery. Why would you have a pulley system that is underneath the place you're trying to get to? Makes no sense. We're going to have to get all of Twitch chat together and just build one ourselves to test it. 
Well, hear me out. Um, hear me out. So you've got, you've got, Woo! you've got. Which prom? I'm getting, I'm getting derailed. Can you actually land up there? That would be so sick. Woo! Twitch prom. You've got these massive stones, right? Seventy thousand kilogram stones. And not only are Let they him cook. And not only are they heavy, but they are transported from a place called Aswan. Or Aswan. I don't know how they say it, but Aswan granite stones. Nine hundred kilometers away from the pyramid pyramids of Giza at the Giza Plateau. How? How did they transport the stones? Well they used the Nile. Still, you need a really good boat for that. You need a really good boat or fleet or something to transport that big of a stone. And then not only that, but like, I don't know how close you can get with the water to the actual pyramid. Then you have to carry it all the way up the Giza Plateau, which is quite a hill. And also up to the base of the pyramid, and then you have to get it inside and up into the pyramid. Now there's speculations, right? How do they do that? Some people believe they used an external ramp. A ramp outside the pyramid. That would extend up to the side where they needed it to, and then they went in. Place the rock simple. Done deal. Well, not so fast. Because for humans to actually like pull the thing all the way up, it would have to be more material than the entire pyramid itself. By like a lot. It would have to be a several kilometer long ramp of gravel, and there's no traces of it. So that unlikely. And the Grand Gallery, not really likely either, because it's underneath the King's Chamber. So what do I propose? What's my theory? Me, the streamer, the expert on Egyptology, who's never studied it, but has an opinion regardless. I believe the big void. The scan So these are the granite blocks above the King's Chamber. They're quite clearly... Uh, shown. This is the Grand Gallery, which kind of looks like, you know, could be used for pulling stones. Uh, there's a void right here. And I'm not kidding, that's not something I've made up. Scientists found the void, same as they found the, um... The North Face Corridor that was really recently explored. This thing right here? Think about it! You use this to pull stones, where do they end up? Oh, right there. Right there. What's this? Who asked emote? Oh no, it's a Peppa, Peppa W. Okay, well, this was recently confirmed true. So this one should be true as well. Have I been there? No, but I really want to go. I really want to go. I think who need to show the Doku again so we can imagine it netta. The documentary, yes. <laughs> I don't believe in aliens. I'm not a conspiracy theorist. All I'm saying is, this thing right here probably holds the secret to how these stones got up there. And if we figure it out, that'll be cool. Because we could appreciate the accomplishments of people from 4,000 years ago a lot better. Who do you think built it? Egyptians. The Egyptians built these things. Are you okay? Yes, but I'm passionate. I don't know why I care about stones from the desert from a long time ago. At the time these were built, and for the next several thousand years, they were the most impressive monument humans have ever made. I know there's theories like, oh, they were power plants, oh, they were uh, landing pads for the aliens, ah, oh, they were whatever. No, I think they were literally just human creations and proof of what humans can do. Womp is okay. Well, now I have cooked. Did you enjoy my meal chat? Did you enjoy dining at Virtual's Diner? <laughs> 
What is inside the big void? Isn't that a great question? See, isn't that a great question? What is inside the big void? Nobody knows. Nobody knows. It's never been explored. And it's quite likely it won't ever be because the government of Egypt is terrified, mortified of damaging the structure to get access to it. Because they recognize that the pyramids are so important for tourism that it, it, any damage to the structure would be haunting. I mean, fair, yes. Woo! Absolutely Goodbye. fair. Just very unfortunate for fans like myself. This might not be legal, but... What do I think it contains? A similar type Woo! of structure to the Grand Gallery. Um, and that these were not made as monuments. Or like, gathering, whatever. But literally just something they had to make for the construction of the pyramid. Like to lift the stones. Uh, this is wrong. Where do I go? What do I use to get... I, I have to get over this. But I don't understand. I've gotten so lost in the pyramids. Ah, <gasps> uh, okay. It's to the left. I had the right idea, but the wrong idea. I had the right, but wrong idea. Hey, virtually, we're gonna finish by 516. You have advanced two track points. Well, the pyramid is said to have taken only 20 years to construct, and I'm talking about, of course, the Pyramid of Cheops, but it's very likely that it would take a lot longer because you can have a building plan. Of course, you gotta finish it before the Pharaoh dies, but you gotta be careful as well not to make any mistakes. You don't wanna haste yourself and step wrong and accidentally have the entire building fall apart, right? So some caution is required, but not only that, not only that, but sometimes things take longer than you set out and thought they would, and that's okay. Sometimes it takes seven months for a main channel video. You said two weeks. <laughs> Sometimes it happens. Why? Uh, it's going to happen again. Ah. Uh, See, whatever this surface is, it's weird. Compared to a normal wall, it's very strange. I think it's plastic. I'm almost there. I don't know if you guys can tell that I'm getting tired, but I am. And I think I'm getting tired in a typical, like, over-stimulated way. <laughs> but progress! Now, where was I? Oh, pyramids, right. Gonna do a run afterwards? Today, no. Tomorrow, per chance, yes.
The problem is, though I'm fascinated by the pyramids, I could never actually, like... Make content about it. I'll leave that to the pros. Those who study it extensively. I am car guy, but I'm also interested in... Triangles. But one day... One day, if you turn notifications on... I will go live on this channel, and it will say IRL stream from the Pyramids of Giza. One day. <laughs> I will dedicate an entire stream to it. You aren't allowed to film? How then have I seen so many documentaries about the pyramids? If no one's allowed to film them? The... The very fact that there exists so many videos about the pyramid should prove that you can. No? Why do you care so much about this? I don't get to decide it. That's the crazy thing. I don't. It just piques my curiosity the right type of way. And it joins a big family of things that have piqued my curiosity enough that... Did you hear about Zeck Pyramid in Germany? One block is placed every 10 years, and it will be finished in year 3183. The artist made it at the 1200 years anniversary of his town to represent how much 1200 years is. Uh, that's just copying the Twitter account, Minecraft, but I place one block every day. They're building a house one block every day. He just straight up ripped that off from the guy. Not to be a downer, but like, come on. <laughs> come on. No, camera. Curse you. I will try to fix it. It's been like this for the last few hours. It even was like this when we started, no? I can't remember. Basically, I'm gonna have to go get a new cable for it. Uh, but for now, I'm just trying to have this cable live its last moments. But yeah, um... What was I saying? Yeah, no, there's things that pique my curiosity the right way, and I can't, I can't decide it. You have the pyramids. Um, another thing that I got really interested in was Roman history for a while. Um, Scrabble. Competitive Scrabble, I got super interested in. Oh, I have to go, okay, yeah. So it's around. There are things that are interesting. They are inherently interesting to me. I don't make the rules. I just... <laughs> go where my heart leads me. Did you add people fishing for Joel? Would that not imply Joel is getting murdered? By all these chatters? Your favorite fish? It's ice. Oh, it's ice. Oh, you made it ice, Lent. You made it ice. 
it looked so much like platform. It looked so much like... <laughs> Which extension? That would be 7 TV. Eighty seven. This might be the worst way to grab the checkpoint, but fine. We'll be done in twenty minutes, Cac W. That was about the pyramids. That was about the pyramids, okay? We'll be done with the pyramids in twenty minutes. What is the party with Ashlak about? I don't know. Uh he hasn't said anything. It might already be up. The Norwegian podcast I went to. Icy tires. Ooh. Can I turtle with that? Oh, it's just getting dry now. Nice. Checkpoint 88. And then what? Up to the red. Yes. Hmm. It feels homely to see Mark emote in my chat. At first I was like, damn. Do we really need all these expressions from Mark? But I taught my brother about them. My brother doesn't really watch my stream or play Track Mania much. But I was like, yes, yeah, so there's this German streamer. And then whenever something questionable happens, you have this interview, uh, this emote called interview, where you point a microphone at someone and ask them for an interview. And now, with really no relationship to Trekmania streamers, Trekmania, uh, or Mark Stream, he, he's been doing interviewing. <laughs> Oh, that's far. My brother's older. I'm the youngest sibling. I don't know if that's... It might be hard to tell. Honestly? I don't think you would guess that, but... No, yeah, I, I'm the youngest. <laughs> wow. Seriously, what? I cannot believe that I exude any younger brother energy. How old's oldest? Three years older. I have a sister and a brother. But we're all relatively close in age. <gasps> Perfect. We're on the home straight chat. It's only 10 left, basically. If I can get... <laughs> Where I think Cleopatra was buried. To be honest... Cleopatra was not that interesting. To me, at least. The only history of Egypt that I find super fascinating is the older history. Like the old kingdom. Ooh. 
personally, I'm a big supporter of the internal ramp theory. Welcome to the movement. Welcome to the movement, brother. The other day, I tested Janek. <laughs> Janek is one of the most scientific people I know. Very, very, like, logical in his thinking. Like, you know, rational, like, okay. He will think about things from the standpoint of logic. And we are talking about something, and I can't remember how we got into this, but I basically said, like, yeah, but the moon landing, was that really real? Like, do you think they actually went there? Like... And in, in, in a classic younger brother energy, the, the reaction I was looking for was, was just the... Like, his eyes just opening up like, what did you just say? And so I went like... Yeah, don't, you're not, maybe they went there, but like... You know, how could they have live streamed the moon landing in like, 1860? Uh, 1960, sorry. So long Whoa. ago, right? Which prize? Hit 12 months. Always good to catch a stream live. Don't you think it's more likely they just recorded those things this and then Sigma is probably went to the moon, yeah. but actually just the showed the footage? Landing. PFFF, you believe in the moon? <laughs> <laughs> Believing in the moon to begin with, yeah. 1967, right? They went to the moon. Whoa. But maybe... Which prize? The NVIDIA video on the moon landing is very cool, shows that it was legit. That's what they want you to believe. <laughs> no, I don't wanna- I don't wanna go there, but... But this is what I did with Janik. And he was not happy. And he was not happy about it. I was like, bro, you're bricked up. Your mind's bricked up. I should say. Why does bri bricked up does not mean what I think it means? <laughs> to me, it seems like it should mean like you are like far gone. <laughs> it seems like like you are so brain rot. That your brain's a brick. That's what it feels like it should mean. Now clearly it doesn't. Blocked up, bricked up. Okay, well, none of these things mean what I'm getting at, I guess, but... I really just think Woo! the only way to understand Surprise! slang is to make your own slang. That way... No one can, like, say it means something else. Because you made it. I just need to think. I just need to see where we're going. Is it down there? That just looks like scenery. That's 93? Hang on a second. Why am I seeing 93? I should be seeing 91. Ninety-four? Where? Wasn't these ones like- no, these are later 90s. Uh, 
nothing there. Already seen that, 27. Huh. What? You saw it? I did not see anything. I actually didn't see it. Uh, but you're right, it's there. What? Yeah, I'm jumping out of that wall ride. And I have to stop here? I guess. Push your hair up. It's a vibe. It's supposed to look like this. That's a cute emote. Okay, so it's like... <laughs> Oh, wait. I actually kind of did it correct. It's a reactor here. But a reset if you go too low, and then you can drive Whoa. up the wall. Which seven months a cage. Salgion, think of the seven months. You started telling a story? Yeah, the story was just... Me being very annoying because I know Danic likes science, so I was being Which very one? anti scientific. My seven months is better than his. To see his reaction as proof of me being the younger brother. This is young thing of the seven months. I actually take that back. As the younger sibling, I would never think to do anything so vile. What's going on? Who's adding emotes now? Who is the mayor of the town? Didn't Hatchet only add seven? We need a new mayor. Johnny? Twitch bra. We need a democratic emote process. I, I'm adding emotes because I waited two years for this. But you're adding emotes outside the people's choice. Chat knows what's best for them. So I think we let chat add the emotes that they want. One mayor after another. 91. Is it all no steering? Yeah. Uh, whoa, that's kind of cool. Wait, that's sick. What a checkpoint. It's pressed backwards until you hit the thing. Reset. Then you get a reactor to go all the way up this. Then Woo! Which less speed for that? Or no more. A little bit more. Arb taking the nine months. No, it's less. Okay. Woo! We're going Which forward bra? on the respawn because you need the speed. If you look how closely the car barely makes it up to the reactor boost, it is not by a lot. So what about this? Not sure. 
Platy ball thing at the prime. Just drive it forwards. It's no steering. Is the ending also no steering? Oh. 20 minutes? Well, to be honest, it's not really far from it. Your original complaint about 7TV was issues with moderation and emotes being random words. I'm offering my services as an expert emote moderator who knows what they're doing. Let me cook. What do we think, chat? What do we think? Our current system has worked, I would say, flawlessly so far. Do we gamble? On Johnny? Or on one mayor at a time, adding seven emotes, removing three? I will let you decide. It's, it's mine and yours, chat, but you use it the most, far more than I do. What could provide the best conversations? Do you want a little bit of chaos, but mostly order? Or a lot of chaos with some order? I'm just thinking of the stories. How will chat treat the guy that dares to remove Joel? I feel like this okay. point, if you remove Joel, from the chat, you have declared war with the people. <laughs> These people, they want, it's like a fidget spinner, but a fish. They just want to see the fish spin. Imagine trying to be a politician and the people that you need votes from are the people that want fish to spin. But like, they want it to spin a lot. 93. He was so young and beautiful. Woo! Which prong? He's back. He's back. <laughs> you thought you had him on the hook, but Joel spun like he's never spun before. How can I see the emotes? Uh, you need something called 7TV. 7tv.app is the website and um, it won't just work on my stream but a lot of other streams use it as well so it's pretty good that's too fast no that's too fast that's that's too many that's too many oh no oh that's way too fast love your content it's not healthy i'd like to teach you a new english word otherwise yes, yes. which can replace 90 percent of your use of else keep up the good work otherwise did i say else a lot otherwise or i'm happy to learn otherwise is a good word And else I've taken too many of already, so... <laughs> Thank you. 94! We have five checkpoints left. We are basically just waiting in the checkout line right now. And as we're there, you're passing one of these... Um, rate your customer service today machines and it has like a smiley face or a frowny face what do you think about today's stream chat smiley face or frowny face a Woo! quick poll Twitch prong. smile smiley face have you ever clicked one of those and told the machine what you think like irl All the time? This guy's Sigma is 
Dude. I always walk Smile. past them. Do you do it if you're exceptionally happy about service or if you just are not pleased at all? Oh my god. This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Joel. Truer words have never been said. This man spoke Whoa. the truth. Which bra? This is the most I've seen my name. What's happening? <laughs> There's a fish spinning with your name on it. Oh. Woo! Which bra? Okay. It's a long Whoa. story. Which bra? Thank you guys for the primes. I appreciate you guys using them here. This guy Sigma is... Dude. What's Wait. the respawn counter out? We will actually know when I finish. I'm gonna guess five hours. Probably like two and a half thousand respawns. Not middle. Woo! Okay. Which bra? 96. Which bra? 97 is above, but I don't know how. This guy's Sigma is... Dude. What? Seems Whoa. like you have to go from... Which ah, bra? I see. It's here. That's a big dump. Prime. More primes, thank you. The people need Joelist. No. Sometimes as a parent, I think a kid will make an unreasonable demand and you have to say no because you want the best for them. You want the best for your chat. Staring at a fish spinning above the legal spinning limit is not healthy for your eyes. Joel spins fast enough. <laughs> ah. Cool. Ninety-seven. Now, how much speed is this? Something like that. Woo! Which brush? Nice oh hair today, dude. It's so close to the end. Thank you, Kendra. Thank you for the the prime as well. It's so close. It's right there. Just up. More speed. What? Ha more? I already used a lot of the space. Okay, no, it should be fine. <laughs> Wait, did Intox get banned? You have served your nation moderately well, Intox. Appreciate your effort. I will say this goes for anyone else down the lineage. If you are the one with the power in your hands, Look back to great rulers like Intux. Use your power wisely. 
I will say this, Intox had the option of adding 10. Woo! Twitch Prime! Not one of them were horny emotes. And they are the rule and not the exception on 7TV. He thought about Joel before anything else. That takes some focus. Whoa. <laughs> I didn't exactly know where to go. I just wanted to do it in one go. Because it was so cool. Did Hobbit delete his account or change his name? Uh, his name is like Dell and then a bunch of numbers. Woo! Twitch Prime! Ah. That's Hobbit? That is Hobbit. I was surprised myself. No. Okay. Hobbit and Lingo name changing something dumb? Yeah, no. Never happens. Oh. Okay, so it's... There's a flag, so it's like, there. I aimed correctly. Kinda. But I got scammed. That was not my fault. Did you know you can use your Twitch Prime to subscribe to your favorite content creator for free? You should, otherwise you're missing out on cool emotes. You can't. And if you're on YouTube, Woo! and you're one of the 50% of the viewers that are not subscribed to virtual TV, this is a great opportunity to do so. So you don't miss out on the content. And also, uh, Buckley really wants to hit a million, so he gets a play button. And I actually think he starts to the server, but we're so far Twitch away. <laughs> Help! Subscribe to Virtual TV Chat. We're so far away from the million. I just want to. I got. Oh, do I have the picture? Oh, I don't know if I have the picture of what I want to show you. There's a picture of Buckley. We're in. This guy Sigma is, dude. Uh, San Diego for TwitchCon US and Buckley made it's downstairs. Whoa! He made Twitch a Prime! statue where it says best dad and he gave it to me. And there's this picture right after he gave it to me where he's looking so proud. He gave me a statue with best dad on it. And I think it would be Whoa! great if I can return Twitch the favor. Prime! And give him a 1 million plaque where it says best son. Okay, it probably has to say Buckley so he can bow it to his friends that it's actually his and that he didn't steal it, but... But, yes. We gotta get Buckley a plaque. We're almost there! Left is faster, clueless. Is it? You know what? It probably is. It can't always be, but it, here it is. Oh, I think I've seen the end. If it's like the bumpers. Okay, we're actually... <laughs> although we're two track wins away, the ending of this map is so weird that it might still take a while.
How late is it? I mean... One full run? After this? It's not impossible. We'll see. I'm definitely interested in playing this map more. As crazy as that sounds. Is the circle here necessary? No. The answer is no. What now? Let's not press forward. Uh, down here? 100. So just a drop down. Be deep at many checkpoints. Definitely going to trial maps now. You enjoy. It's fun to, after a lot of struggling, finally see yourself completing a challenge. Last checkpoint. All you have to do here, I've seen this from others, is uh, drop down to this ledge that you see, <laughs> uh, and then. Pray to whichever deities you believe in. Because uh, this is the last checkpoint. <laughs> okay, I've seen people take way longer for that. That is not at all easy. But I beat World of Wampus number 6 in 5 hours and 40 minutes. With a few technical issues. 2,194 respawns. 49 minutes if I didn't respawn once. There's a lot of room for improvement. I kind of I kind of want to do it again. Like how long could a run take? 49 minutes? Looks easy. Uh, before I do that, though, I would have to go to the bathroom and a few other things, but I might do another run. That was fun. Uh, what is the record right now? One hour 50 from Nace, 2.11 from Scrappy, 2.27 Janek. If this is a first one, that's a really fast time for a first completion. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> I'm last. But I'm sure if I didn't talk about the pyramids, I would likely be these three guys. I'm last, but I still beat a difficult map, okay? Top 10, top 10, top 10. Top 10. Bronze medal. Author medal 259 might be a good target for the next one. But guys, uh, before I do another run, uh, and I will try. I think I'll just go to the bathroom, get some food. Because uh, these are exhausting maps to play. So give me a, give me a quick moment. We can watch the world record while I'm uh, AFK. <laughs> See you in one hour. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'll be right back.